Welcome everyone back to Mersenhammer. Last time uh, we left off with the party just having fought their way onto the beachhead at Death Island. Unfortunately, I didn't have pillboxes deployed in Onfalad, but I did have a horde of skeleton warriors who were tentacled to death because Vasca is broken. Yay! <gasps> Look, having a having real tentacle wizardry also would have helped with a lot of you know beach assaults. Frankly, look, I'm not saying it's true. Would have helped the defenders, maybe. Well, you well, know, I I kind of want to see Wolfenstein with even more magic now. I feel like we would have only been more tempted to nuke the Japanese if they could summon tentacles on command. Yeah. No, we we just wouldn't have stopped after the two. <laughs> okay. Just fucking keep going. Um, it it's in character. The joke would be on us. It would only made them stronger. That's true. That They'd seems to have been literally true. Let's say so let's beep you on over to this map, and um, it does seem that only um the good Baron Polnareff is injured. A few people got injured. Well, yeah, but yeah, everyone but else got the rest of them got fixed. Oh, okay, fair enough. Have I? Did I roll to try and heal Polnareff? I think I'm you probably did. Good. You rolled uh, a one. Oh, that's right. I rolled a whole hit point worth of healing. And then I, I should have, whenever I find my body. Uh, <laughs> you should probably find that. I don't think you should have there lost. I am. Uh, oh, apparently I did not drink enough blood wine. Uh, how many blood wines do you have? I actually have that written down. Uh, five now. Two will top you off, and then you'll have three. Uh, I'm just not going to top myself off. Are you sure? Why would you want to be anything less than full health, my dude? What the fuck? Uh, because then I'll be wasting one hit point? That, that's okay. That's better yeah. than just being gilled. Like, what, are you at three missing health instead of four or something? No, I Seven am... instead of eight. Oh, right, well. Yeah, dude, you should totally just chug two. So, um, okay. I, I had six, so that's... Chug, chug. That brings me down to four, and I'm good. Well, you Rock need chug. Alright. So, uh, let me just make sure I've got the character sheets open I need to have for you people I'm going to be having to baby. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, yeah, the actual people you must babysit until they arrive. Yeah. Alright. So, we've got Luminitsa and uh, poor Rosalind, who will eventually kill something, I'm sure. Eventually. And I have a uh, Fletcher. And Philip. Okay, so how long does that spell take? Ooh, ten minutes. Uh so yeah. Fletcher will offer to um use a spell of eternal rest that will stop um stop any of these undead from being re-reanimated. However, it takes ten minutes to cast the spell, so he can't he can't do it to all of the individual ones, but perhaps he could do it on this bone giant. Well if we can only real, do it real question, does the does the Colossus count as one or many? 
Um, because of how they've all been put together, each Colossus counts as... Fair Same enough. with the Bone Giant. Although I think the cores were taken out of those Colossus because they were ended rightly, quote-unquote. So I think they can't be re-risen, -re right? They would need to be reassembled, like, with evil sciences or whatever the fuck they do. That's an assumption you could make. It's an assumption I make, and I'm sure old man Corpsington would be able to roll the actual answer to that or not. Uh, let's see. Yeah, that's a fairly good assumption. Uh, certainly, even if they were, uh, even if it was possible to raise them, again, they would be significantly weaker, and that uh, the individual body is comprising them would not act in concert. Yes. Are you willing to have him take ten minutes to do that to a thing? Uh, yeah, it seems fine. Mm. I don't want the Bone Daddy to rise up again. Okay, let's have him chat. That would be yeah. inconvenient. I should probably use three spell dice definitely want, you know, to succeed on this, and not to ten minutes. Yes, he should want to succeed. Yep, succeeded, didn't even get doubles, so yes. Man, how lame. Is the person who did not didn't get doubles either? I mean, my doubles are a little more dangerous. Well, you should have thought about that before you let a demon give you a wound. Now the now the ice cream is pretty well let any of that space happen. time out. <laughs> that wasn't my choice. Mm -hmm. Was it? Was it not? Was I, it truly I, not? I signed no contract with a demon giving me a womb. I did not I, do that. Yeah, sure you didn't. Uh -huh. Yes, and, uh, and and I don't look at porn either. My well, computer no, you don't. You consume off. it. Yeah, My you do, you ravenous off. beast. <laughs> Storing your cheeks like a hamster for winter. <laughs> what the fuck? Not gonna Ooh. lie, <laughs> so that's, that's pretty accurate. You literally do have an end of the world storage of it. Yeah. We all laughed at him, but after the internet finally failed, failed us, and the Chinese banned all the yeah, porn. we had to we had to we had to contact Bob to send us pornography by telegram. <laughs> <laughs> How horrifying! <laughs> that's, that's pretty scary. <laughs> like a lot. It would be the darkest right. timeline for sure. So yeah, ten minutes will pass by. He'll uh, drive a fragrant steak through the giants skull and uh, he proclaims it shall not it shall not rise again now if you trust more to succeed here um i have a virgin alt dwarf to... <laughs> <laughs> oh god all right let's move on then yep uh... So, you wanted to head towards the uh, Basalt Tower. That sounds familiar. Yeah, I mean, I remember that whole place as being mm -hmm. some kind of salt tower. Calls to me. <laughs> oh, it's enough to make a man sick. Alright. So, um, though you would think it being there 
what should be a clear landmark would make it easy to get to. There is something strange about Malphic Isle, and unwelcome guests often find themselves badly lost. You're going to actually- I'm going to actually need a person to make a navigation roll. Only one of you can try this. Um, uh, you, I'm pretty you can't go at, like, you know, one person goes and then, oh, I don't know, and then the, the other. Because you do have to take the lead and be confident in it, even if you're wrong. Hmm. Oh, boy. Oh, no, no, I'm wank at navigation. As am I. Actually not trained in navigation, I thought I was. I think the- I think Gunnar is. Yeah, he's Gunnar's been our navigator all this there. whole time. He isn't- he's see. fighting orcs. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it's an expert skill, like, I've never had a class that trains in it. Uh, Does Rosalind get it? Uh, you, you know who gets it. Father Fletcher. <laughs> Well, well, Fletcher, I guess so you're up. We have up. to fucking wait for him anyway. Awesome. I mean, can I substitute oh, no, no, outdoor I'm survival to, with a penalty or something? Um, roll four. I'm, not, I'm very disappointed that I don't have it. <laughs> Even if it's at a massive negative. Tally, house. Yeah, I wanted to see a tally higher. Yeah, I think the negative is so massive. I'd rather just like, not. There is, there, there is no negative. You just can't do it. Yeah, just can't. Yeah. Oh. I, I mean, even if I had just like 10%, there's a 1 in 10 chance of it. I, I say we just wait and let him roll, and then if he, he fails, we just blame him, of course. I mean, I, I could roll... We mean wait as in for him to do the spellcasting. Oh! Not for him to get back here. Yeah. So, I, I assumed you weren't just herring off without him. Um, oh, I assumed we were, because he's not here to play at the moment anyway, so it made sense that he'd be occupied doing that and then heroically turn up when Rem turns up. Eh. Eh. But also, I'd rather, I'd rather just Murs make the roll. Hmm. Yeah, so... So, none of you are trained, so none of you can even assist. It's, uh... Navig... <laughs> I don't think any of our assistances would have fucking mattered. No, nope. no, but not that we could. Literally none of us are trained, so we rely on Father Feet Fletcher to get us through the darkness. Somebody give me a bunch of your XP so I can train navigation real quick. Ah, uh, Jesus. Nah, I'm not giving you any of mine. I'm saving it up so that I can buy 3,000 advances in weapon scale. Well, I guess we're getting properly oh. fucked and lost. It's not that bad. Um, we're on Death Island. Entirely that bad. I mean, Yoko Yoko wandered around for like two hours. It's fine. Let's see. I mean, he <laughs> could fortune point. Not only did she wander around for two hours, she also told some of the resident spirits to go fuck themselves to their face. I mean, <laughs> to be fair, they all deserve it, too. Yeah. I mean, I probably didn't get lost in the dark, but it's not like we didn't do shit about it anyway. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I will um, pop one of his fortune. Let's see. Oh well, it was a good while it lasted, guys. So see you next week. Yep. Oh okay. boy. All right. Well, Two sixty percent. So, guess I need to slightly change up the encounter. Great, great. Uh, could you put yourselves in a marching order facing east? Uh, no more than three. Ooh. Facing east. And, uh, Savin, you like fun. Roll me a 1d8. Oh boy! Oh no! Ah! 
Did I do good? I feel like you um, you did decent for you guys. Which disappointing. Oh, sorry. It's okay. Not apologize to the person who would have us killed. Oh, that was... Ah. Uh, oh, well. Hmm? What? Uh... Forgot to do something in advance. Now all... Oh. Uh... So, yeah, just give me a quick couple... Never mind that. Can't find that what I wanted anyway, so I guess I'll just run with what I uh... Three bone pillows. Uh, also, the Vaglent and uh, I are talking about when uh, when we when we tried to actually eat salt. I know me and Rosindy have both done this. Mm -hmm. To eat salt, sorry. Yes, like cups of salt. Oh, um. I did once have a shot glass that was exclusively salt and vinegar. Why would you Why? do that to yourself? Huh? Because it won me 20 quid. It was also oh, a terrible okay. experience. I imagine it would be. Mm, did yeah. the 20 quid make it better? Yes. I spent it on alcohol, which immediately removed that problem of taste. I... Okay. I mean, it's not like someone bets you to do that sober. I mean, you're not wrong, but... At least you'd hope she isn't wrong. Yeah, well, oh, yeah, no, I fucking, I fucking love a salt and vinegar shooter. Nothing to quite make you want to vomit out your asshole. Nothing makes you want to cleanse your system. I don't hate myself enough this very second in time. Let's do, let's change let's that. Let's give myself a reason to. Yeah. I want to feel this in my goddamn kidneys. <laughs> Oh boy.
two that's two hundred and forty grams of Where would you like Luminitsa and um, Fletcher in the marching order? At the back. Okay. The if the horse could shit on the father mid travel, that would be cool. <laughs> That'd be pretty amazing. And you know, Philibert for now will just be hidden. We have no Philibert idea where Philibert is. He is in Philibert land. Yeah, you can literally just um, remove him from the map and we would not know the difference. Until a shovel abyss. You say that, but fucking those crits. That crit potential. Well, I, I didn't mean his like combat abilities. I mean like we literally can't see the fucker. Oh, okay. Alright. Also, torches. You're going to need your torches. I will. Torches, I will torches. cast light again. This Don't time with greater respect armor. for uh, magic on this island. I'll just use one die. Also, Poot. because it has a casting number of three, so I can't fail. I will not use light. That sounds like a, a statement for gamblers. No, I mean mathematically, I cannot fail. Yep, my has I know what you've said. Math has failed me more than once a time, my friend. You can still get a one. Which... I mean, I get a one, but the spell still goes through, doesn't it? No. Really? A one is an auto failure. Oh, wow. Okay, never mind. And you go insane! Well, test for insane. Yeah. I knew that. It's mm. why, um,. It's the downside of only ever using one dice because, like, it's like if you get all ones on your casting roll, you um, you you suffer. Uh, uh so let's see. Um, okay, so those four of you in front. Avonclad, uh, Vaska, Fizi, and Rosalind. Yo. Uh, you each need to make me a negative 20 perception test. Okay. Do I need to make a negative 20 perception test? Yes. Okay. Do I get a bonus yes. thanks to having the sixth sense? Uh, yes, that'll actually cancel out the negative 20. Oh, so it's magic. Don't you worry about it, though, because my perception is sure is still a raw dog 33. Never fucking mind! <laughs> You're fine! And Rosalind. Ah, she fails. She was staring at my ass, I understand. It happens to the best of us. <laughs> Alright, so. Walking along, following Fletcher's directions, skipping from the back. And. You three all realize in time to dive out the way, but Rosalind is a little too slow. As the grass shoots up with coiled spears. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Yeah. That's... Good thing she's a play. <laughs> well, she's, um, plate on her. T Body, right, that's right, only far. torso. Yeah. And, you know, this does... This being a spear of plant matter shot from the ground... That... Yeah, no, I it... can understand that hitting the legs instead. I'm not gonna yeah. argue that point, let me say. <laughs> no, because her plate protects her... Her... her Dignity. I, 
yeah, her dignity, so obviously she just saving faces through the pain. <laughs> Not a hobgoblin. Come on now. <laughs> right, and she lets out a grunt of pain. Hear the sound of growling from behind. Fletcher turn Fletcher glances back and that informs you. You have friends. Oh good. Is that what we're calling them now? I was concerned we had enemies. Frenemies. Puppies. Oh, oh. So let's have everyone roll on this. No, puppos. Hey, I oh, don't have they... to use magic here. I did it, guys! I rolled the best I ever have. Aww. <laughs> Still less uh... than your minimum, Jesus. <laughs> I did not cut myself quick. Please be added to the turn initiative. Actually, I, it's Warhammer. I don't give a shit. <laughs> It's not, it's not 5e or my next will just be a 20. So yes, there are puppies. Also, loud, drunk students outside. Yay! Just Welcome like an all door. season of the year. Zombie puppos. Yep. Well, I guess I'm gonna quick draw bow. And quick and not move, actually. Actually, hmm. So I don't want to run into the enemies because I want to get my full attacks off. But I feel like Fizzy or somebody else is going to run up. Are you guys of the mindset of wait for them to come and then full attack them, or do you want to rush into an attack? I them? mean, I will probably shoot them first with their repeating crossbow. Okay, then, then I will definitely on team shoot. Draw a bow and take some shots. Yeah, I'm not charging off into the darkness to fight wolves face to face. I will let them approach. <laughs> I will attack the one leading the pack, assuming I can hit. Yeah. Alright. There is a tree there, but you know, trees have branches and you're mostly seeing branches. Alright, then I'll attack Just... the one at the right, since, you know. Okay. Man, rolling high 80s and 90s today. Yep. Oh, let's see damage. Uh, did he dodge any of them? cannot dodge. Okay. Damage, 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 and... Wow, okay. Let's know okay. that my dice look from yesterday, last week, is still continuing strong. Dink, 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 dink. Would it kill me to roll above a 5? Apparently. Okay. Uh, yeah, you. Ha it takes all four arrows, but you do eventually put the um put the bad part. Okay, at least they're squish. Squish enough. Yeah. Squish enough. Yeah. All right, and then yeah, we'll quick draw. Uh, one of the uh, swords for parrying, but that's it. That's my turn. Uh, you. Rem remember, you can only quick draw once per. Oh. Oh. Okay, never mind. Yeah, so like, you know, I, I, I let you, you know, quick draw paired weapons, like two swords at once, because that's cool, but you can't quick draw a bow and then, you know, quick draw another sword off. Fair enough. Alright. So, Luminitsa or Radiha Needles and... 
guess I should quickly open up the rules handout. Um, so I make sure I know the correct actions. Uh, yeah, and I guess take a defensive stance. So let's put shield on that. Rosaline, are uh, they in your range yet? No. Yeah, she'll um, take an action to firmly stake her torch into the ground and turn uh, ready sword in the uh, pit. Right, a thing happens. Father Fletcher, um. What can he do? Uh... Hide and cry. Uh... Uh, the most famous and illustrious tactics. Actually, he will draw a line on the ground in chalk. Oh, sorry, in chalk. successfully casts a spell. He does not. <laughs> More I doesn't fizzy. love you. Ah, with a sigh. Uh, let's see here. Uh, is this tree obstructing my shot to the southern direwolves? If so, I'll just shoot top left instead. Uh, not really. Okay, I will shoot at mid lane. Um, yeah, it, it would it obstruct your shot to this guy, but you can shoot mid lane. Okay. One, two, three, eesh. Well, wank. Hmm. I mean, you can upgrade it a bit, but yeah, that's... Yeah. It's not hot. Happens. Baron Polnareff! Assuming Bob is back. Bob does not appear to be va back. Uh, Vasky, you'll go before. Sure. I'm gonna... One, two, three. Just gonna... Move up here. And, um, I guess brace my shield and I fight defensively? What's the fucking version of that? Uh, defensive stance is a full action. Hmm. Uh, I guess then I will delay an attack in case somebody gets near me? Sure. Yeah. Give him the pokes. Right. Oh wait, hold on. Actually, wait. No, I'm retarded. There's a thing I need to do. Desperately. Uh, a Theracama? Yeah, that thing that wears off fucking 60 seconds after I cast it, because it's retarded. Oh, God. Fucking hate that so much. I'm Come sorry here, you armor. can't just create eight plate mail for free. A doubles. All right. Would would you like to um fortune? <sighs> Jesus, I'm gonna run out of fortune points just avoiding magical mishaps. Also, be right back. You uh, you could take the glacial surge. <sighs> Fucking, I gotta save these fortune points for vampires. So sure, hit me. Alright, so I guess I'll let you hundred. Nice! I did! Zinch again! No! What so much better! Side? Vaska just lifts off of her feet a aura of 
just a stream of cold wind pouring out of her eyes and mouth. Um, Savin, roll me a, um, a, a d10 to determine which direction a frost fiend spawns in. Ah, well, fuck, come on. Glad Let's... you're making this simple encounter much more easy, uh, much more entertaining, Savin. Uh, <sighs> Never a dull double with you. <laughs> Surely it just appears in the direction she's looking in, which would be one of these fucking monsters. Uh, well, you'd like that, wouldn't you? Yeah, I'd love that. But no, Unfortunately, it's it appears within three yards. Oh, well, we're fucked. That screws up all of our weapon uh, skills. Six and yards, time. sorry. Okay. Still but still, three bad. squares. Yeah, that's bad news. Also, goddammit, Vasco, why did you move forward? So I could fight the things. Uh, also, oh, in you, case this happened, you could. Hmm. Yeah, you didn't want to. You moved away to avoid self-destructing on all of us. Oh, but I think you've just spawned it. Spawns it spawns in the middle of the party. Yeah. yeah. So fucking, not <laughs> yeah, only exactly. did I not get my attacks on the wolfos, now I just got an ice fiend right in front of me. Yeah. Right yeah, up your literally, ass, kid. Literally, literally appearing in this fucking niche here, and You've it fucks literally... all of our abilities. It's you okay. Frost fiends are everything. fucking terrible. We found this out. No, they were terrible because it couldn't be near the party because it did bad things to us. It's gonna do bad things to us. It like, couldn't do bad things to fucking wa ghouls. You're because fine. Because they're undead. That had nothing to do with it. <laughs> You're just bad. At our level, like All holy right. shit. What's the what's the order? It's like negative twenty weapon skill. God damn it. You like a hundred weapons, so shut up. Yeah, yeah but have you fine. seen how many 80s I've been w rolling today? Oh, negative 10. It's not even as bad as I thought of. Okay. For you, for you that's Split. fine. You still basically don't ever mess, but fuck, that's really um, an annoying um, place. Is it hostile to us? Yes. Oh, is it hostile to the sake. wolves, though? The it's wolves hostile to everything. The of course, it's a frost fiend. Face, though. Say it, that also pushes you guys. It pushes the horse. It's bigger uh, than the horse. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Still, the horse weighs like a thousand pounds. Ah, uh, fuck. Still, I mean, you've, you've got your ferret armor. Yeah. It's true, I do. Yay! Um, Vasca, <laughs> is that on our side? It roars in, yes. um, hate. Is I what on our side? I mean, that's oh still shit! Not an frost to me. fiend. I speak the language of anger. That's a no. It's okay. Fuck. <laughs> it's... Don't worry so much, guys. You're gonna be fine. All right. So Baron Polnareff, um, your friendly ice wizard, um, has just vomited out what looks like a demon. You know, as you do. <gasps> This isn't the first time. Get used to it. Mm. So yeah, um, what do? <laughs> well, the whole party is just jaded to the nightmares that come out of a spellcaster by this point. Yeah. Fuck <laughs> 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 you. Uh, oh come on again. <laughs> no, holy shit! What the fuck is that? Look, we're just oh come Try on. It does cause fear. Uh, now, a few of you are immune to that, but not all of you. Huh? I, I've i been a frost fiend. Am I immune? Essentially. Well, the Fletcher is <laughs> not that... immune. I feel like all the mainland like party members are just like, we're so used to this shit. Like, you've never does seen it... this shit before. Like, does it one... part a negative? I'm... You've well, never I'm seen immune. a frost fiend before. No. I'm immune to fear because I'm undead, though. I know, but also, like, you're not that used to it, because mm -hmm. this is the first time it's happened. Oh. Nice target number zero, dude. Man. So, I mean, yeah, that's everyone who has to roll that. having success, having yeah. succeed. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, Bob, it is your turn. Well, I was gonna... Uh, valiantly just uh, charge the doggos, but um, God. God. give up. I guess I have uh, more scary things to take care of. Um, God 
damn it. Tire tiring is minus twenty, isn't it? No, no. minus ten. It neither. Oh. It means you only get the impact quality when you charge. Oh, okay. Well, goodbye. Clearly, I'm hitting the only thing within reach, so... Yep. <laughs> it does have dodge, so... Mm -hmm. Your first thrust is turned by the... Uh... Okay, and your second one follows through, though. And it doesn't start with a prepared parry, so you, you've, you've got it. Okay. Come on. I mean, if you destroy <laughs> that, that doesn't count. He didn't charge. He didn't charge. It doesn't count. It's six. That does. Yeah, that, wow. that was a fucking the, the ten. Lady, the lazy thing that gives me the he's second. Still, yeah, he's still, got, he's still got budget. I have impact anyway. Yeah. From the Lady's Grace. Yeah. Oh. Hmm. Okay. So go ahead. Roll another D10. Fucking delete this piece of I want of this shit thing D10. to appear in front of him and then get destroyed immediately so badly. <laughs> it is gonna get destroyed. Oh, no, uh, damn it. Like, if not in this hit, then, like, on Avon's turn, it'll just mm. evaporate. One more attack. Oh, I would hope so, with, but with my damage rolls, I'm not so... Not yeah, so see, that, that's half its health gone one hit. I mean, one hit as hard as, like, harder than me and Avonclad's damage combined on some wolves just a moment ago. <laughs> yeah. Sad oh, bandage. man, look at him go. He's Still. a fucking machine. Don't forget the horse kick in the deck. Yeah, have the horse kill it, quick. Orcs Fury. All Rex Horsey. Uh, where's the horse? Horsey, horsey. It would be named War Horse, as opposed to Horse. Horse. Minus ten. I, I doubt it's yeah. Oh. Okay. All right. So. Oh, she tried. Now, bad guy turn. Well. Hey, the good news is. Hey, they're inside the aura. Yeah. Also, raids. <laughs> Quick, keep the frost fiend alive so it penalizes all the bad guys. You know, Vastu. just chop its arms off. A wraith just blinks into being in front of you, swinging its scythe in a deadly arc. I feel like oh, blit! Be to finding Ding. those by now. How many times I've been backed by them? Unfortunately, invisibility is invisibility. Unfortunately, visibility is something you never get used to, even with super magical special L5. Yep. Now, I've got bad news for um, our temporary party members. Wraiths cause terror. Wraith does what? They cause terror. Mm. No. Hmm. 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 So, flex. Of course he's fine. <laughs> Don't sound so disappointed. I did it again, God. Um, but uh, I think I still, yeah, I still pass. Yeah. And yeah, that's basically it. I mean, the rest of you have um, grown sufficiently used to fighting the spectral undead. So now. Puppos. Uh, how far can you go? Oh, you have a movement of nine. Hey, no fair. Puppos are not allowed. To oh, me. I, I kind of expected them to have like sit a uh, high, guys. They're Quick, fight than the horse, frost fiend, so. you big mangy bastards! <laughs> Shit. Alright, come at me. 
They're coming. Oh, oh there's God. a whole extra wing of them. Nice. Mm-hmm. Oh, there's the two whole extra wings I can see. You. Nice, nice. All right, so, um... So I have terrible news. Mm. The fierceness of a direwolf's attack can overwhelm even the strongest melee opponent. They make two ch attacks during. Cool. Hmm. Which is actually more attacks than they normally make. Oh, yeah, that is. Hmm. I I was about to say I don't think these guys are gonna have like a billion attacks. They're shitty. So, but yeah. okay. I... Wait, can they make? Can they make more attacks though? Two attack attacks, yes. apparently. Uh, That's don't weird. forget their minus ten from Frost Boy. Yeah, okay. Yep. Um, I that's why they've that. only got a net plus oh. 10 rather than a plus 20. I guess I'll dodge that, actually, since that's uh, not, whatchamacallit, penalized. Yes, it is. It's agility. Oh, is it? Yeah, oh, damn it. Well, I yep. guess it'll be a parry, then. Do, 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 best Q shield. Minus 10. Here we go. Hey, I did it. Ding. Yeah, that's it. Two more attacks. Haha. Haha. Alright, now it's going to be three attacks on Luminator and three on the flag. Oh, Jesus. Less than three seconds have passed before everything has gone to shit. <laughs> so, Luminator or. Yep, uh, so now two more attacks on. Ooh. Well, I feel like Luminita is having a real bad day. Oh, actually, no, no, I forgot she was in defensive stance. Uh, those didn't actually hit. Yay! Um, so yeah, uh, on Father Fletcher, who is. In here, there's a shield, so it went. So that is going to glance off of his armor. All right, top of round, Avonclad. The puppos are descending. The puppos are descending. Ha! Uh, well, have to move either way. Plan wait and bake has uh, failed me. And there's a wraith. There is. I don't remember if these assholes attack real good. They don't. I, don't I mean, trust if you. they hit, they do a ton of damage, but... Quote-unquote, a ton. Look, you were disappointed once. I'm disappointed a second time, too. This thing sucked. Well, I'm gonna make sure it stays sucky. You pull out the Bloodfire scimitars and attack it. Minus ten. Actually, do I get any benefits for grouping up on it? Yes, it's outnumbered quite considerably. Um, so your net is looking like a plus ten. Okay. Hit right arm. Yeah. <laughs> Hit the right arm. Okay. Big surprise. <laughs> Hit the left leg for net minimum damage. You can upgrade that, right? Yeah, I'm gonna upgrade that. <laughs> okay, um... I can upgrade and you can that upgrade by... that by... Four. four. Make that a twelve. Yeah, that's enough. Yeah, um... Okay. Roll 
a um the one hundred plus. Yep. Thirty one. Okay. Thirty one. Uh, that is five on. You knock the creature to the ground, swing through the icy sinews of its leg. Uh, you'll have an additional plus ten for your follow-up, for your um, continuing attacks. Awesome. I'ma hit him again. Jeez, these high rolls. Well, let's yeah. see the damage. There, there we, we go, go, finally. Been a while. All right, I can. I'll take that. Twenty twenty-three, Dan. All right, you cleave the frost fiend's leg clean off, and it shatters into fragments of ice and mist. You miss swirls and quickly returns to Vaska. Oh, good. Now people can hit me better. Hmm. Hmm. To be fair. Oh, All right. That's weird that dire wolves would use weapon skill. For everything uses attacks. weapon skill. I know it's just yeah. weird. Weapon skill is but, weird. It's stupid. Yeah, I guess that's my turn. It's not. I just said it was um. Stupid. Oh yeah, it's weird, but you know it's not stupid. It's actually how this shit works. Yeah, it's going to. Go out with some needles. I know truly is stupid in this world. Well, two hits, so Aristocrats. Yes. She just pierces one through its, um, you know, right side and it falls. Rosalie. Or raise her pistol and blast, um, no, that one's too far away. Blast this dial wolf. And of course, misses. Nice. Good, good job. Yeah. So. Can't roll six. Now, a thing happens. Oh, more things. Yay. Yeah. This is why you don't get lost. Number in of flick. A number of spirits. Uh, red cloaks. And shaped like miniature elves just flicked out of the trees. They have sharpened spurs they used to hack and slash at you and undead alike. Oh, nice. Oh, there's one next to me. Great. Yeah. Oh, they're adorable. And then they start slashing other. It's like, oh, no, no, no. no. Fucking Shreks. Vaska? Yes. <coughs> oh, that was a, that was on me. Okay. Yes. Uh, well, I guess I'll try and parry that shit. Do, do, do. Oh wow! I couldn't actually see them. They were <laughs> so tiny and small. Nope. All right. Ow. And um, would you please make a minus ten toughness test? Oh, good. Poison. Yeah. Oh, no. Ah, uh, Jesus Christ. Hold on a second. Um, I'm going to use a, uh, a lucky charm on that one. Okay. Go ahead and re-roll that. 
do 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 minus ten. A hey, there we go. Cool. Uh next one will be on a dial. Nice. Right in his eyeball. Oh god, right in his eyeball. Yeah, the direwolf uh, falls with a um, kick from the little sh And she um, coos triumphantly and does a little dance. Next one will be at uh, Baron Polnareff's war horse. Oh no! No, no, not the horse! Alright, if you want to have your horse of aid, you're going to have to use your right skill. Mm. Uh, no. Oh, okay, my ride skill, right. Yeah. That should uh, be your best skill, right? Mm. Apparently not. Oh. I mean, it's pretty high up there, it's just, you know... When you're all 94, unless your name is DCL, you're fine. Uh, I don't have that many fate points left. I, I gotta, I, I guess it's just gonna have to hurt my horse. Oh, of course it's an Ulfric Fury, why? Alright, 16 damage to the horse. Um, it is in the body, which, you know... Is covered by your horse's farting. So, team minus seven is nine. Okay. And as with Vasca, your horse needs to make me a negative ten tough. This is what's going to screw me over. Yep. Did I just come back to Polnareff getting bullied by a fairy? Yeah. You came back to Polnareff's horse dying. Oh. Yep, it's dead. Oh. <laughs> Perfect. Like, it did just enough. And then max damage for the poison roll. Yeah. So there's where your luck was. I mean, it takes a critical hit. It's not dead. Well, I mean, fair enough, I suppose. It is an important thing for him, so. I mean, guess they are one over on. 18. Oh, it's so, locked. five. Bo Oh, wow. Game really I, wants to kill the horse. I, I, I assume uh, that it actually just negates armor, right? Uh, the poison, okay. yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so yes, uh, your horse... Uh, you're going to have to make another ride roll for me. Jesus Christ. Uh, as your horse stumbles and falls to the ground. All right. You manage to dismount safely. You are not um, crushed underneath it, so. It's... Don't worry, he's a real knight. He's still going to make charge attacks, but now on foot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just sprinting at people with it. I'll fuck you up! That's right, it's just me, a terrible one. enemy. Well. Yeah, and that's the Shrike's turn, and actually I suppose I should, you know, put them on there. They had a very productive turn. Yeah! I mean, for being spirits of murder, they are very much. They have for spirits of murder, they are very much. Fissy will summon them to her aid like a cloak of murder. Summon a murder of fairies. Yeah, shit. Mm -hmm. Can I try and proselytize these fucking trikes? Uh, on your turn you can give it a go, sure. Um, it is. Well, that's Fletcher. Yeah, yeah. 
Yeah, I mean, I guess he'll try to, um, try to channel and grope a direwolf. I, I would hope he would not grope the direwolves. Trying. Wow. Good start. More. Wow. <laughs> Just sucking the big one today. Mm. Mers's dice are. No, no, no. That's this is just par for the more course. <laughs> yeah, I hope that's doubles. Oh. So he does need to test his weapon skill to grope it. He grab. He uh, just shoves his stake into the direwolves. I see you, spirits of murder. How about we work together in Cain's glorious name? Beyond these mere simple wolves are the truest beasts. The undead deeper within. Uh. They giggle and flit around, and for a moment you can't tell which one is which. They're all just seemingly co-located with each other. Finally, one seems to localize long enough to uh, speak back to you in a little sing-song voice. Uh, what language? <clears throat> uh, the elven. Dope. Gay fairy tongue. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yes, yes. We know we're waiting. Excellent. Well then, I have a veil you may ride upon to our destination. And I will indicate the blood-soaked scarf that is my holy relic. I will invite them to ride along on the journey to the castle. Feel right at home. Oh, I bet Palmer is going to appreciate that. So, are you going to make any mention for trying to stop him from killing your party members? Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, I will in fact tell them to uh, spare those who would work and join in Kane's glorious name, and I will wave and indicate my companions. That will require a um, fellowship test. Sure. Plus 30, because you do have a holy relic. Of blood and murder. Yeah. Yeah. Woo, nice. just bad. No, no, I mean, I mean, the thirst flurry is because of the relic of blood and murder. Yes. Mm. Yeah, no, I, I said... Oh. Alright, so yes, um... Vaska, one withdraws its spur from you and uh, and st just starts fluttering towards uh, the oncoming dire wolves with a murderous grin. Uh, Fizzy, is there anything is this else you want doing? to do, Fizzy? Uh, yeah, I will swap to the common tongue. Um, don't worry about the little fairy looking things. They're going to help us kill all the undead now. I'm gonna walk up and fucking ship the shit out of a wraith. But what about my horse? Your horse is I, it's it's not dead. I can fix that. I'm pretty sure it got stabbed in a leg, which is just a right arm for a horse. <laughs> Let's ignore um, the, the horse is Let's dead, ignore. right? No, Let's ignore the it's just it just got proned by a critical oh, effect, right? Okay. Yeah. I thought it actually it's, died. You know, on death's door. Let's ignore <laughs> the fact that horses are often put down if they eight break a leg. Yeah. Well, we got fucking magic, so it's fine. It also enough. didn't get hit in the leg. It got hit in the chest. It got hit in the chest and then poisoned. <laughs> that got oh, stabbed yeah, in it'll the be, heart. It'll be that's fine actually, anyway. Yeah, that's actually better for it. Fuck you, Wraith. Oh my god. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna actually reroll that. I really do want to put some damage down on this bastard. Hey, fuck your arm. What do Wraith do? Uh, your spear is silver. Yep. Everything in my armory is silver. Alright. Well, it's an ordinary wraith, so... 
it just has to sit there and take it and be. Why does it say cut us? It's doing that fucking thing for me as well. See, it's not <laughs> just me. I'm not yeah. insane. Yeah. Weird. I'm not well, crazy. I mean, yeah, I I stab it in the stab hole. Yeah. And it's I had to charge that, so I, I don't have I don't have more stabs. I'm afraid that was I... charged. Polnareff, your horse is probably dying. Admittedly, you landed on your feet. What are you going to do? I really want to stab a shrike. I will ask really nicely, Polnareff, please yeah. don't stab a shrike. <laughs> okay. On another figure, how the hell am I going to charge? A two, I'm too close to charge a dire wolf. You can back up a step and then just... There are more it. dire wolves! You, know you could just you could just sally forth on come your down own here. feet towards these guys. C come There's down here, of, it'll be great. A lot of dire wolves everywhere. You're, you're yeah, or you, or you could charge this fucking wraith. Yeah, yeah if you could it's end up like here, that'd wolf. be fantastic. Do I have that? Oh, come on. Come on. You have like four squares, right? In fact, I mean, you have more as a charge. Uh, yeah, you, you, have, you should have eight at least. I have eight, yeah. See, so, yeah, you can end up like here. Or here. But, but the charge, I have to. The last the last thing has to right, be in a straight on. line. You can go like. Yeah. There you go. It's, a straight line. I, straight line across two. two all right. <laughs> the math doesn't add up. So it's, I mean, it's not a one square straight line. It has to be ten feet of square. Two, right, so so squares. the square. So you can't be like diagonally. That's weird. I mean, it can be. It's just um, it would be like here, then here, and then. Okay. Then oh right, yeah. Because so that would clip the right square, right? Okay, then you just end up like here. Like do you know what? Why, why not just double stack the impact, right? Right. <laughs> Fair enough. I don't um, see also, why. Remember I... when you're um when you're on foot, a lance is two-handed. You have to uh, drop your shield. Ooh. Ooh. That's fine. Fuck that guy. Why would you need a shield? These wolves can't shoot you. Yeah, but that is also parry. And there's no way. And I don't have quick draw, so I can't just holster. Dang it. Mm. Okay, I guess I, I guess I'll have to. Like prop it up against my horse. Okay. Well, well, I hit it. You you do. Go go ahead and roll down. <laughs> All right. Can, can you get to third you got nine? A <laughs> got a triple. Don't forget, so you can roll another one of them. Yep. No. Okay, no. But thundering does mean you score Ulrich's fury on a nine when you charge. Wait, question. Mm -hmm. Didn't he do a charge? That yes, yeah. that's literally what we've just covered here. He gets three three types of D10 because he's got his charging D10, he's got his um, magic D10, and now because he rolled a nine, he has an Ulrich's fury. Yes. Oh no, I was asking. Oh wait, no, he didn't make multiple attacks. Never mind. Also, no, he can do that. He can. He's just on attack like, number one. I, I could, wait. He's a human. How is he charging mm -hmm. and doing that? I'm so confused. Magic weapon. He's got magic oh, hands. I thought that was just because he was on a horse. No, horses are not voodoo. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Voodoo? Uh, you strike. Voodoo. You strike the wraith in its skull, and it shatters in a uh, blob of ectoplasm. Hmm. Slightly disappointed because I wanted another skull on my spear. On my lance. 
Just with the mouth that came like, ah. Un Unfortunately, Brits are a little more attached. Yeah. And, uh... It's Vasca's turn. Hmm. Uh, alright. Well, uh, that Wraith being dead means I don't have to waste my turn disengaging, so instead I'm going to give this direwolf a stabbo. Because I've learned my lesson about casting magic for today. Have you? Yes, actually. I'm a... I okay. don't believe you. Poke. <laughs> oh. And... Poke. Oh. Goodbye, spear. Yep. The spear is st uh, stuck deep in its hide. You, you just couldn't pull it back after that first thrust. It's probably oh. got spleen juice on it now. Ugh. That's a real shame, because... Uh... Kind of hoping to get rid of this guy. Actually, wait, no, it's better that he lives because he can only make one attack on me. Yeah. Uh, so now, dire wolves. Um, oh boy. second wave charges. Yay. Uh, yo, yeah, damn it. yo, yo. Come at myself, wolfos. One, two, three, four, uh... five, six. Yo. God damn, this is such Yo. a close fight. I should have left when I had the chance. I don't know what you expected. Right. I, I should have stabbed the other doggo. I kind of expected more doggos to go over that way. Why, right, but then they wouldn't be ganging up on us. Look, don't use your logic on me. It's not fair. Alright, so... A doggo will try to eat Father Fly. Nope. Uh, now, uh... Going to have one attack on Rosaline. Right. Um... Oh, actually, no, that should have had an extra plus. Uh, no, no, actually, it shouldn't. It shouldn't, no. Um... On even clad, though, it does have an extra plus ten. Even you're being uh, mauled by a. And this is where Paul Nerf is. Even clad? Are, are you just going to take it? PCL? He's on mute. So watch him Sorry, I was things. making food. Well, uh, what's going on? You a dog is trying to eat you. How many of it actually hit? One so far. All right, I will. I will dodge. Roll him real high, but two more coming on you. Okay. I will parry. Alright. Where are you, parry? There you are. Good, good. Alright, this one. Uh, next one along, I guess we'll do one attack on Feezy, one attack on Polnareff. Uh, Feezy. Palmer. No. Um, next one down. Attack on Fizzy, attack on Vaska. Mrs. Fizzy. Uh, hits Vaska. Alright, now we'll attempt to shove my shield into its fucking pie hole. Good choice. Oh, nope. Alright. Would you like to reroll? Nope. Wise Fuck decision. Off. One more attack on. Can these things even hurt me? Uh. 
Is it? Are they just rolling a raw dog d10 for damage? No. It's a uh, plus. Yeah, there's a plus four. Oh, okay. Fucking can parse that math there. Right. Okay. Yeah, they just that's really how strength bonus is calculated. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so, I don't I'll think just, there's anything you can do against that. I, I can dodge. Can't I? Uh, didn't you do that against the, try that against the Shrike? Uh, no, that was last turn. Cause no, that was this it? turn. It's still the same turn. Is it? Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Well, I guess I'll just soak that then. Yeah, no. I mean, I don't think that does anything to you. It's... No. No. Alright, Polnareff. There are five attacks coming on you. Well, don't worry, they're bitches. Yeah, I have no Save. idea to defend against any of them. You've got dodge, don't you? Okay, yeah, I can dodge one. You have your pectorals, that's all you need. Well, that's one hit, so... Might as well dodge. Move. Alright. Stop. Uh, 12 yeah. damage. I don't actually think that does any. It's close. Yeah, but no. Yeah, you took no damage. Goddamn. Right. You're so strong. I have more. Well, I mean... Alright, I, I, I don't have any more. <laughs> Your armor is very very sturdy. Um, Aiden Cloud, no. the wolves are... Alright. Put on my Hot Topic shades and sell them. It's time to show them the true wolf among them. Hugh, Hugh, Hugh. All the I All indicate right. the shrikes are allowed to kill Avonclad. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, okay. Uh, this one, since it's next to Lady Rosaline, I'll attack it first. So, sure. Bloodfire Skimitars. Go! Ooh, that's a good one, but it, can he dodge? No. Nice. Uh, I'm going to upgrade that by... I think... Two? I think you're gonna upgrade that by two. Yeah, I mean, upgrading it at all was sufficient to kill it. Oh, okay. And then I will swing at this one. One to the north. Boop, 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 do. A hit. And a 14. Yep, that kills. Boop, 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 boop. And then I will attack this one. Ooh, a good hit. That is a solid hit. And dead. Because I'll upgrade that, for sure. Yeah. I just have two more attacks I don't know what to do with, so I guess that's my turn. Can you quick draw a bow or something? I mean, I could, but then I mean I wouldn't have a parry. Do you However, also have to one? drop both your weapons to the ground. Yeah, which we've discussed as to why I'm skeptical about doing that. And these are just dogs. Yeah, it's not it's like fine. They... There are only a handful of wolves left, but also these guys, yeah. these dogs would absolutely steal a magic sword that was dropped on the floor. Are you kidding? Look at them. Yeah, and then bring it back to you. Oh, it's like cool. fair. <laughs> oh, adorable zombo dogs, but no. No dropping, that's my turn. Alright, Luminitsa will hop on top of a dead wolf to kill another. Or you'll try. Rosalind. Uh, guess we'll. I guess just charge down. Go on, Rosalind. I believe in you. I'm just glad I've got a little cadre of adorable murderers. At last! I've got followers, I can take Sergeant. <laughs> <laughs> My little band of merry matterers. Alright, she cleaves off its right hind leg. A strike 
next to it, pouts, and uh, it flits past her, uh, gives her a very rude gesture. Aren't they adorable? Uh, I just need to move you for a sec, Vasca, so I can get that one out. Okay. Uh, and yeah, um, that one will point at Ava, will glance at Fizzy and then point at with a slightly questioning look. No, he too is an acolyte of murder. You can swear it looks truly disappointed. I know, I know. I give it the stink eye. Then, I mean, I... guess this one will just... help double team a direwolf. Oh my. Oh my. Not that it was needed. Right, next, a uh, long at the top. Wow, Shrike actually missed. That's more on the form. Uh, Father Fletcher, um... Can't really do much. But... There, there aren't enough spaces available to kill the remaining direwolves, so... Yeah, if he's... I get a turn? That's not supposed to happen. Uh, well, there's one in front of me. Uh, time to do it a stab. Uh, attack number one. Yep, you've you've hit. Uh, you've killed. It. Hmm. These ones are very disappointing about how quickly they die. I will shrug and uh. Drop the spear to the ground, quick draw my pistol crossbow, and bap at another wolf. Shot! Pew! Nope, mid string goes. Well, fuck. Yeah. Really, uh, your knuckle really smarts where it, uh, where it hit it on its side. On my gauntlet? Eh, fair, fair point, you do actually have plate on. <laughs> I mean, I can feel the shame. The shame certainly harms me, but... Mm. Alright, Polnareff. Alright, uh... Yeah, might as well just get the one in front of me. Don't have any sort of gang up or charge. Not like you particularly need it. Uh, can it? Oh, it, it can't dodge, can it? No. <laughs> wow. wow. I mean, do you get a bonus for double Frick Fury? No. Uh, I mean, you just, don't just, need it. Just, These things die like bitches. Yeah. Uh, just bragging rights, really. Uh, I mean, you've got a couple more attacks, <laughs> and that was a... Hero was getting shot and you've also... another turn. Yeah, and you've also got a new prize. Um, it's not a Wraith Skull, it's a Wolf Skull. Ah, yeah. <laughs> it's still with the mouth open, like, ah! Oh, no. Oh. Uh... Alright. In the name of a lady, you have decided to play fetch with the dog. It fetches you your lance and sets it at your feet. <laughs> the double horned remaining wolf. Uh... Go on, Vasco, finish the job. 
amazing. I get turn. Uh, can I get my spear back off this dead fucking doggo? Yeah, since so, since it's dead, you can just grab it uh, All right. freely. I'm just gonna huck it at that wolfo that's next to Paul Raff, I guess. All right. Uh, let's see. Do 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 do. I did it. Okay. But not quite enough. But wait, I have another half action. And that means magic missile. Alright. Don't fuck up. Channeling. No. Ingredient. Uh, no. Not another frost fiend. It's okay. I can't roll a frost fiend. I can just go insane. Uh, no. Poot. Oh, well. Bring me that back. Dying. He could do. Yeah, he he wouldn't actually need to leave Polnareff. Answer. Come on, boy. Come on. Give him a lance uh, back. Comes running for you and leaps up to give you slobbery bites. Yay! The foulest smelling dog breath you have ever witnessed. Yeah. Mm-hmm. We're pretending this is cute, but really it's just a really it's a nightmare. Barreling at me, <laughs> chomping on my shield. Yeah. All right, Avon Clot. Um, there's just one left. I. I'm almost afraid to even make this swing. Okay. Okay, it's done. Oh, I'm not even. God. Yeah, of course. The Ulfric Fury, well, it doesn't matter. Oh well. I mean, we've done a lot of Ulric Furies just exclusively on these enemies that aren't a threat. <laughs> it's. You're not wrong. Well, I'm not going to bother rerolling. It's dead. <sighs> Alright. Um, I will try <sighs> and heal your horse, and I will invite these shrikes to climb onto my scarf. Sorry about Giant. Uh... Snow monster. That's never happened before. No. Last time you turned into the giant snow monster. Yes, normally that's intentional. And that was not. Alright, so let's see if I'm as good a horse doctor as I am a Conrad doctor. I, I fucking am. I feel it's strange that every time you cast a spell, you learn something new that magic can do that you didn't mean to do. That is how magic works, yes. It is chaotic, largely <laughs> random affair. Alright. Now... Now to give my horse to... Yeah, do you wanna, do you wanna give him some fucking laudanum? That'll really solve your horse's problems. <laughs> oh lordy! Oh laudanum. He named. <laughs> Yay. Is that him casting it's not as bad as you nay? Uh, on Vasco. Oh. So it uses power on a horse. It's healthy, like a horse. I got yeah. two healing potions left. Uh, would you I like should have spent more money. one of mine? Oh, uh, spellcasting fair. Oh, for oh. fuck's sake, you worthless morite prick. <laughs> God damn <laughs> piece of shit morites. Well, at least you didn't go insane from it. How would we be able to tell? He would talk more. He might get interesting. Uh, that's true. Yeah. Um, Polnareff, uh, Vasco will offer you three uh, healing droughts if you would like. He will take them. Because he's proud, not stupid. But I have small condition, Polnareff. Quince. May I pet your horse? You may. Uh, taken all the horse blood out that's supposed to be out and put the horse blood in that's supposed to be in, so... And yeah. I get bit by uh, a horse. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, gonna make conversation with these shrikes in, uh, in Elven. If they speak with a Dark Elf dialect, I will speak with a Dark Elf dialect back. Which is like uh, Elven, but with fear boners. 
once I've gotten a sniff of your scarf, yes, yes, they, they very much switch, and seem very excited and giggly about having been able to make that sort. So what do you want to talk to them about? Uh, I want to ask them the quickest way to all of those vampires and cultists so that we can murder the shit out of them, first of all. Mm. Uh, Madden Sister's Sacred Grove. <laughs> I see. Oh, fair enough. So were there ablations to Cain that brought you here, or is it just particularly murderous in the air? I'm asking how they came to be here. Like, yeah, yeah, I'm just trying to, um... Problem with fairies and so on is that I'm not so good at coming up with their shit on the spot. Alright, oh, no, then we've got janky dialogue. I mean, the benefit with fairy and fae is that they can't remember and don't care. So they literally could have just came here on a murder, drunken murder bender. And that's well, their story. I don't know, they've kind of got that whole, like... Eternal memory and vengeance and mystery and getting people oh, lost that... in the forest and never forgetting promises, that kind of shit. Oh, is that how Faye work in this? I mean, they're based on, like, the European Faye, and it's that they they never forget literally anything. I thought Lesser Faye... They're, would... they're airheaded, but they never forget. Yeah. Okay, I thought Lesser Faye, like, forgot things that weren't important to them. But it's like, if you made a promise or a deal with them, they'd remember that shit forever. Hmm. And I mean, they would remember this, because it's how did they get here in the first place? I mean, I don't know. I don't know enough about the actual Fey lore to argue. Mm. Um, I, I'm pretty so, sure Warhammer Fey are, are very much just like evil Irish Fey, by which I mean just Irish Fey. Yeah, I was about to say. I thought the Fey's were dicks by nature. Mm. Yeah, yeah. They are. I mean, calling it chaos is unfair. They just don't give a fuck. They don't have a morality system. They are incapable of having fucks to give about others. Yeah. They lack empathy unless they were born to have it in the first place. And they can never develop it. And the closest they come is a severe hatred towards every other creature. So, are you talking about orcs? Or are you talking about demons? Or <laughs> talking about humans? I'm just... can, can I talk, please? Oh, Sorry. yes. Sorry. Here we've been, and deaths we've seen, since skies were light and moonless were white. Hmm. Interesting indeed. Before humans came then, and brought their footsteps on the ground? Yes, yes, before all things. Very well. Should that prove boring to you, you're welcome to join me after we've murdered all of the vampires here. Goodness knows I've got a great many places to wander to. I consider your offer, but... They are, as is their way, largely inscrutable. Fair. Then you. Yeah. And hopefully we can make our way on to our destination now without getting fucking lost some more. Yeah, we just needed to find the murder fairies. Be our guides. <laughs> I mean, it was it was a bit of a hassle. We had to kill a frost fiend and a bunch of wolves. But hey, we made a brand new friend and no one is the worse for it. Except the horse. Nope, the horse is totally fine. <laughs> that. I'm an excellent horse doctor. It comes from <laughs> dealing with people with Conrad's constitution. <laughs> well... Hmm. I have nothing I could say to that. So, just good job, Fizzy, and we'll continue <laughs> on. <laughs> just good job! I just 
Yeah, you I look confused. Like, I'm not used to actually being literally complimented. Mm -hmm. I'll be damned. <laughs> you, you continue to be a credit to the team. Good job. Hooray. Yes, it was a very good job. Unlike, say, Father <laughs> Fletcher, who led us into fucking spirit ambush. Mm, yes. My expectations aren't <laughs> especially <Yeah>. high. <laughs> it's, it's hard to be angry when your expectations were really low. Just to get with. I just look at it, it's like, oh, our only guide is this guy? Well, <laughs> one second, I'm trying to hold in all my surprise at how this is going to turn out. I expected, I expected nothing. It <laughs> was that fa fa failed a 90-something percent channeling test and rolled fat ones on the easy ones. And... I expected I nothing, and I'm still disappointed. Yeah. Oh, God, where's that from? I forget. <laughs> Uh, but... I think it's the Malcolm in the Middle spinoff. Oh yes, it is. Yes, it's it's Dewey. Well, all right. Dewey got a spinoff, us... really? Uh, yep. No, no. In uh, this line, he had in Malcolm in the Middle. Oh, uh, oh, but Dewey did get a spinoff. He did. Oh it's god, it's called the Middle. Yeah. Which is Malcolm in the Middle minus Malcolm. It's just the dad. Isn't that while he was just at college and then the family is falling apart? Oh, that's uh, unfortunate. I just know it's. I just know it's the most recent one, so I don't know. Uh, okay. Well, I'm still that sounds fondly, depressing. Yeah, I'm it fondly does. reminded of and terrified by the statement when he's like, "Look, okay, so I did all of the. I did the math. I did all the planning. I can work the extra jobs. I found a way that I can go to college." And then his dad tears it off in front of him and goes. You can't go. He's like, no, I just proved I can. He goes, no, you can't. You know, every single time in our lives where we've said, we'll find a way or something will happen. You're that something. If you leave, we're doomed. <laughs> and I'm just literally going like, this poor fucking kid. <laughs> you are on the backup plan. What a fucking future. Ah, sorry for that non sequitur. Onwards. Yes, onwards. Perhaps the Shrikes can lead us where we need to go. So that's the thing. They start leading you. Uh, you're not being led towards the tower, it seems. Hmm. Ooh. Indeed, you're island... going away from it. This island does no. seem strange. Maybe we're actually still in the right correct. Correct I path. have no reason to disbelieve them when they've said they'll get us to the direction we need to go in order to kill all the vampires. Hmm. Even if this is the wrong direction, we'll simply murder whatever waits for us and continue onwards. Yes, oh. that's generally how it works. It is very possible that Her Imperial Highness is not with the greatest concentration of the undead. That is true. And also, there's the possibility that there's more than one way into a deadly crypt. We don't have to go through the front door this time. There is no way to know one way or the other. Indeed. I'm just excited to see what happens. And yeah. I mean, we got we got lost already traveling with the father, and we thought that we were heading in a straight line towards the castle. For all I know, we are still headed into in, in a straight line towards the castle, but can't fucking tell, so... You know, whatever. Yeah. Alright. So, I will need a, a couple of minutes, then, to set... So... Alright, in if which case, I'm gonna make a fresh hot drink. Yeah, I'm... Yeah. Happy to happy to follow the spirits of murder. Go figure. We're back. Do 
please do feel to, you know, talk amongst yourselves while I'm. Sorry, I am. I am trying to draw things. I am so I'm half distracted. Oh, poor Rem. Oh, Jesus. What happened to Rem? Uh, no. They forgot to relieve him, apparently, from a shift. Well, we're not dead yet, so we just need to wait till we get in the next fight, and then he can save us. Yeah, apparently this wasn't the real fight this session. Yeah, no, no, that's why Rem's late. But that's good. We're not heading towards just the worst part of this island. That's good. We that's... should be. We're heading towards the vampires, who are going to be definitively the worst part of this island. Yeah, uh... <laughs> If there is anything worse than the vampires on this island, I am genuinely concerned. Okay, let me. We're we're not going towards the largest concentration of undead. That's what I heard. Well, no, that's exactly where you are going. Oh, that's... <laughs> that like Fizzy the... asked. No, no, Fizzy asked them to lead you towards uh, where the where the most cultists and vampires and people to murder are. Oh, oh, I thought you asked us where the vampire was specifically. I guess since we have to do an island cleansing anyways, it's not like we're not going to kill them. That is I why we're here, right? That you're... No. Oh, we're here to save you're the here. cleansing. We're here yes. to save the cleansing. That, that is your primary mission here, for now. After you've rescued her, you're meant to, you know, hold a beachhead and, you know, prevent um, the Dark Lord once upon a time from leaving. By the way, we got a snips. Snippy! Well, I guess at this point, we're going to have to have a non sequitur of a battle. Hopefully we won't lose too many resources. I mean, hopefully. I mean, my horse already died once, so... What? I mean, but now we have a snippy, so now we have extra crits on demand. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> That's not a guaranteed strategy. It's not. <laughs> I mean, machine gun is always a strategy, Snips. I throw rocks at people. What is wrong well, with you? I mean, if you throw a rock at the right place at the right time. I also fell asleep a couple of hours before the game started. Oh. I managed to rise myself awake. Before 7 a.m. May. Why? Those are love wolves. Yeah. Am I dead? No, no, you just weren't on the map, um, because... Well, because I snuck care. ahead, of course. Great idea. Mm -hmm. You don't get to finish your sentence. You still fucking get to. Pardon, sorry? Nah. I got you off earlier. Oh. And part of me just really want to double down and do exactly the opposite of all I mean, fair enough, I guess. Is this what being sober is like? I hate it. Alright, so I'm going to need you. Don't need the Frost Fiend anymore. Hopefully. <laughs> I 
Ah, first thing you say. Oh yes, Vasca's magic um did interesting things. Did did fantastic things. Hi, Ram. Oh, hello, Ram. Basically, it's just okay. did nothing in, of interest or import. <laughs> we we yeah. found a it's filler a fight, thing. and it didn't kill yeah. us, which is why you were late. <laughs> you weren't needed yet. So is everything okay? Yeah, we're we're yeah. going towards a, a bunch of vampires and undead to fight, though. So you know, we'll we'll see how that's pending. Okay. I'm sorry I'm late. They actually forgot about Second. me until about 8.30. Wow. How did they forget about a cashier? Uh, because they're busy with the other end of the store. And they figured, oh, so X will tell him to go home. And X will figure, oh, Y will tell him to go home. Well, that sounds like rather rotten luck. Yep, and from this point forward, if it is closing time and I'm still down, if I'm still in the area, 15 minutes past closing, I'm fucking leaving, regardless of what anyone wants. Yep. It makes hey, sense. Um, hey, Snippy. Uh, hi. I have new cult followers. I mean, friends. Uh... I have questions. Oh, you found some shrikes! Yeah, little yeah. spirits of murder. They're riding in my scarf. Found. They, uh, they killed Look, the horse. I know they. I know they nearly killed your horse, but I fixed that, so it's okay. Well, uh, so what's the safety distance again? Let me check. <laughs> we wouldn't Good. know. We've not seen you yet. <laughs> Oh, speaking of, if he's going to be continuing to scout for us, I think maybe casting high from Undead on him might not be a bad idea. Oh, place is already supernatural at hiding, surely. But if it's just mindless Undead, it'd be physically impossible for them to even notice them unless he is actively trying to beat their skull. Yeah, I know, but it already is impossible for anyone to see him. He's incredible. Excuse me, I'm currently teabagging the vampire. Yeah, we have no idea. One day we'll get to the fight and and they'll they'll be like the vampires will think they've won and he's he'll have been there the whole time. No no no, the vampires will go out to fight us and they'll realize um they have no uh they have no weapon, they have no backup weapon. <laughs> they have no they... pants <laughs> They have no pants and their and their laces are tied together. Yeah. No, they I didn't just, even come I in. Just with like the idea that they they take up positions and then one of the vampires takes off his helmet. It's Fiedler. How? Oh, how did you do it? <laughs> it's fucking they wizardry. Come... They didn't even come in with laces. <laughs> yes, oh, no, sure. he stole really? their boots off and then put booted la and laced boots on them just so we could tie them together. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Have you ever have you seen that fucking joke animation about uh, Agent Forty Seven being in all of the fucking hiding spots, dressed even as his wife? It's Fiedler. Oh, it's amazing. I've seen that video. But so, that's how it makes it. If the dude goes be... to bed with his wife and has sex with her, but it was Forty Seven. Oh. No, but here's the thing: if Fiedler wants to be even more of a turbo stealth, he should take the servant class because they get a super special ability. Of so long as he does what people expect someone in his position to do, nobody notices him. I think like, they no, one, like no one expects him to kill people with a shovel, okay? <laughs> he's not expected to steal. He will do, but he's not expected to do it. We expect it, but that's by experience. <laughs> nah, but the servant class is just fucking fantastic. It's Aside from the prelate, the only other class, wait, prelate and scourge, are the only three classes I know of that get in a native. Hmm. That's cool. But I mean, also you could be better at stabbing or stealthing and stealthing and stabbing at the same time.
At Walk-In Scene, the servants are usually beneath notice. It is possible for a maid to clean a room with a dozen nobles gathered to plot treason without them ever really noticing her. A servant may act as if they had the, the skill of concealment or gain plus 10 bonus to it if they already have it, but only when they are in their, quote, proper place and otherwise expected to be there. So they're doing the equivalent of walking around with a clipboard. Yes. You've got to check your radiation shields. I'm from G-Sector. Oh, okay. oh, right. So he Fair could... Enough. Let me open the buckheads for you. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Do that. So he could... Right, well, sorry, I didn't do that impression justice because it was done by Sean Connery, the least servant-looking man ever. Mm -hmm. I'm just here to check your radiation shields. <laughs> Please, no, but... us hard workers of the G section are just as valuable as any of you. But that's the thing, Snippy. I mean, this Fiedler could walk into the Imperial Palace with a bucket and a mob, and no one would say a damn thing. But they already don't because they never see him coming. They never see him coming. There you go. Fiedler was fake. What was going through my head? Oh my god, you might actually be able to walk into the fucking great college there you and go. go. Yeah, look, there you go. It's physically impossible. Nah, it's just... How many degrees of success? Over six, so it doesn't matter. There's no one being there. <laughs> fucking... 94 agility. Without even doing point by. This is just. It's incredible. It's Sean Kribler. I would no. say that's a whole. I would say he that's is definitely a human. A human. Legally Thank speaking. You. He has the documentation. He stole it from another legal human, but it's still his documentation. <laughs> One might question why someone else needed that documentation. Well, that's to be said that the original Fiedler was a very ugly man. God. <laughs> that Fiedler is gone. There is only this one. No, Lord. No, my Lord. I am not a mutant. I am just obscenely ugly. I'm not pregnant. I'm just disgusting types of fat. It appears exclusively in the tummy. <laughs> but I just realized. Tell me, how tall is a uh, Fiedler the <clears throat> Hugh? Oh, no, very tall. No, he's small. He's not a normal sized token. <laughs> I, 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 I know, but is he of the appropriate size for being <laughs> fucking punted like a soccer ball by gun? Uh, that's an uncomfortable question. <laughs> I'm not gonna say. <laughs> no You're one... not legally required to answer that. You know, no, yeah, no, no. He's not allowed to. That's not allowed to be on the job sheet form. It's fine. Don't answer if it's there. <laughs> he's not allowed to legally say I am puntable. Yeah, no, yeah, no. That's, that's that's you know, it's like asking your religion. You don't have to answer that shit. I mean, let's face it. In this setting, you know when you look at someone, but yeah, no one ever sees you, so they ask. Thank fucking god. As in, as in they ask in the here. sentence, What man of God are you? Into the empty room. <laughs> what matter of man are you? I am no man. Gardner. Little did they know, he already left five minutes ago with all your belongings. Just screaming at an Hold on, T. Someone took me gold piece. <laughs> the ultimate play. The pants are still on. The cod piece came off, though, somehow. They're wearing a, a, a jock strap, and that's been stolen. Hold on, uh, Snip, what was the question? What's Gunnar's strength? I mean, yeah, because as something tells you, you can turn anyone into a fucking punt ball, regardless of size. Um, when I'm not raging, my strength is 80. Mmm, uncomfortable question. Will not answer. Everyone becomes puntable. Oh, wait. Sorry. When using... You looked at the wrong sheet. When using the form of Chosen Ulrich, 
And might as well throw it. Uh, when also fre frenzying, I think my strength turns into what 80, 85. Not bad. How yeah, much... no, it's definitely throwable, I guess. How much strength does lose your shit add? There we are. Ah, it's 10 strength. So 80. So when using a uh, form of Ulrich. And frenzing, I have strength 90. Wait the fuck you mean? It can actually throw me further than my leap. To a totally normal leap distance. Leap my touch. Totally back. normal leap distance. Which you're very human. You're very that. human. You're very human leap charge attack. Exactly. Has anyone actually rolled a check to see if that's actually a human face or just an elaborately painted mask? It's a leap. I mean, he doesn't talk like a rat. No. Aww. He is not a rat. Tasha's sitting beside me holding my hand and she falls asleep. Oh, of course, it's because she's a support husky, but that does also mean she's about to vomit on you again. No, no, she fell asleep, and I just felt her little hand just slowly fall out of mine. Aww. It was very cute. And then, she, and then she farts herself awake, vomits on your floor, and then <laughs> yep. runs out. Yep. Yeah, I'm waiting for that no, follow-up. She wouldn't do that. She's she would 100% do that. She <laughs> lives to spoil the moment. Oh, that reminds me. I found a bunch of videos of when my puppers are small. Aww. When they were still potatoes? When they were still just potatoes. When they were still Puppet shitting all over my house. Well, no, they're still doing that. They're still doing that. <laughs> oh when they God. were small and I could hold them in one hand. Aww. I never, never come back. I never left. And portable. That reminds me of my kiwi. The delicious fruit. Yeah, that's the nickname of my dog. Ah. Yeah, she's a little Jack Russell. Oh, I had a Jack Russell once. Yep, she was a great dog. We used to live out in the country, and uh, I lost her for, what, two, two and a half days down a groundhog hole once? Nice. Uh, a little after that, she came back missing her collar, scratched up and bloody in some places, covered in dirt, but she was happier than shit. She found her groundhog. Yeah, she won. Yeah, after two and a half days, literally crawling her way through groundhog. <laughs> Look, yeah, that was her Vietnam, okay? We don't talk about <laughs> that. That is what Jack Russells are made to do. Yeah, for uh, Vietnam. Oh, okay. Bye, Tasha. Get in here. Season All right, now smell for farts. Uh... Mm-hmm. Fucking Vietnam. But, uh... Yeah, she's a good dog. She's also the kind of dog that, uh... Would lay in my... Would lay... Would hop up on my bed, lay down, like she owned it. And then when, if I got in... If I tried to scoot her out of the way so I could actually, like, properly, like, sprawl out on my own bed, she would growl at me, like... She, this, this is my bed! Maybe you should teach her. It's your bed. Where is uh, it? Taser? Yeah, shit on it for dominance. Uh, oh, oh shit on it. You're supposed to piss in it. Oh, look, I've been doing it wrong for ages. Look, I, <laughs> then again, I pissed ethanol, so that doesn't count. I mean, they can't Got stop me. I piss ethanol. Dude, I, I, I myself have, have not done so, but I had a friend who drank literally so much that he um he could piss in a gas cap and no, then no, no, power he, the car no he uh he didn't so much wear himself as he took a piss on the floor next to his bed because he couldn't make it all the way to the bathroom he's like well i'm not gonna go in the bed that would be gross and then passed out and then two days later woke up and the carpet had lost its color it was so potent from all the drinking <sighs> that it bleached the carpet i like what how he hell? woke up two days later too <laughs> Yeah, I mean, he did. 
<laughs> I'm surprised he woke up at all. <laughs> That's about to at say. That point, yes. Did anyone did 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 anyone bother to check to see if he was? Oh no, you dead. could hear that he was asleep still. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Fucking hell. <sighs> I miss that dog. Yeah, no, that, that, that's someone who gets what we like to call legendarily drunk. Oh, yeah, no fucking hell, that's horrifying. She, she also had the uh, bit of a habit of holding a toy in her mouth. She would not, like, do a little happy howl with nothing in her mouth. She physically had to hold something in her mouth in order to do this little howl. And yeah, it was adorable. I still have some of her toys up on up on the top of my uh, computer desk as a uh, little reminder. Have her call her, too. Both touching and sad. My condolences. <sighs> she was a good girl. They all are. That's how it works. You can be a piece of shit. Still a good girl. Still a good boy. Then I had another dog, Taz, and She's a white German Shepherd, not albino, just naturally white. Beautiful. I can't even picture that. Oh yeah, I Bjorn. Nothing. I've been blind for years. <laughs> but the thing was that uh, she was terrified of like any loud sounds, like thunder or whatever. Like, and we tried anything like uh, dryer sheets or putting a blanket over. No, but she was perfectly happy if. She heard thunder or loud bangs or fireworks. Just open up a closet door or something and she'll be more than happy to lay down in it and hide from the loud sound. Aww. That's too cute. And she was also afraid of stairs. Loki's afraid of stairs. I, I, I think it's like... Have you wondered that they're just actually lazy there? No, but... she, she could definitely go up and down stairs if she needed to. It was just, I, I think it's a depth perception thing. But I, I have trouble getting Loki on top of a... Basically, it's a... Uh, uh, I'm suddenly drowning. The thing that you measure weight on. A Scales. scale. Scale. It's on a raised platform where I go to... At the doctor's office or the pet hospital, whatever. Uh okay. Yeah, well, yeah. Yeah, my brain is just not working. Uh, <laughs> Don't worry, you've gotten way thingy and dog hospital correct so far. Yeah. <laughs> she, uh, she'll put her two front paws on on the... Uh, <laughs> on the... Uh, on the thing. And then stretch as far as she could to get head pats from the lady doing the measuring. <laughs> <laughs> it's like we need your back lens too, Loki. It's like no, no. You're just sitting there on top of both of us, just happy as could be. Like, it's like, can I get pets? Can I get pets now too? Adorable. I can picture that. Oh, he's got his own problems with. He uh, he'll sleep at the very. For whatever reason, he'll just lay at the very head of my bed where I have my pillow. He just lays on it. So I have to pick him up and move him. But he'll just randomly decide, nah. So he'll come back around and just lay on top of my face like a cat. Just like, no. I've had a cat to do I've had a cat do that before. No. Oh, speaking of cats, uh, I do have one cute cat story I think that you all like to hear. When I used to live over at my dad's a long, long time ago, I had two cats simult almost simultaneously uh, give birth at the same time. Though, oddly enough, both of them gave birth in the exact same area, which was the gap between my bed and the wall. And I didn't have, like, a bed frame or anything, so it was literally box spring and mattress on my floor. So it was pretty close. So it was kind of cute to just uh, hearing little mews and uh, hearing purring as I was uh, trying to sleep or lay in bed. 
it got even cuter when it got to the point that uh, the kittens would uh, climb up to explore. And apparently they found, was it my neck, my chest, and around my arms were a perfect place to nap. Yeah, it's been a late. What? Now, just imagine just laying in bed on your day off, not being able to move, not because you don't want to, but because at least nine kittens are laying strewn across your body and says, like, I don't want to wake up. Yeah, no, no that do it for some people. I had, like, two across my neck, so it was like, and one, like, sitting, like, right next to my one ear. So it's like, I wonder if I can reach my book from here. I think I'm going to stay for a while. It's, it's, it's still obnoxious that you could even think about. It's not fair. Why are there so many kittens? I, I'm not kidding when I said two cats simultaneously gave birth at the side of my bed. I think that was a combined litter total size of, for that one, I think it was 13, 13 kittens Whoever's between two cats. Dang, shit, stop. Oh, seriously, you could, you could pick up on that? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Is, is your mic about? touching your table? It is touching the little, yes, yes, it and is. Yes, that's why. Vibration carries right into the mic. Hmm. It's like magic. It's like science. Well, that's why I it's... had to ditch my Yeti microphone, because there's fucking nowhere I could put it. The one's just getting bonked all the time. Science. Magic. Practically the same thing. Yes, Sniff. Magic is science, and science is magic. Especially in this setting. I love it. Except the part when the moon blew up. That was that was less nice. That's I like that a lot. That's, like that's that. not canon in this world. Oh, Merzendi fixed one of the shittiest parts of the lore. Yeah, I think we can all agree that the fucking end times were stupid. It's just G dubs hitting the big reset button. No, it was G Dub saying, uh, "We have no idea what the hell we want to do anymore with the setting, so uh, we're going to scrap it and do a cheap fan fiction version of it, and sell space and sell space marines in it." I mean, selling yeah. space marine was a pretty good choice, I'm not gonna lie. I mean, to be fair, you get, you bet your ass they're the best selling Warhammer Fantasy models right now. No, the old school Warhammer Fantasy models are still selling pretty well. Pretty because well, a maybe, lot of people, but I, I don't think they're outselling the Sigmarians. Because a lot of people said, uh, fuck Age of Sigmar. Uh, we just want to continue playing the old setting with none of the bullshit. Yeah, that, that's going to keep working right up until G-Dubs uh, discontinues all those old models. You mean they haven't already? And that's uh, with that's 3D printing for... They already have. God. And that's what a good 3D printer is for. Hmm. Although it is, the issue is getting good models for a 3D printer of that shit. To be fair, G-Dub's models can sometimes leave well, a yeah, lot. Well, don't, yeah, you don't, you don't print the shit ones. I don't know. You have the Age ability of Sigma to... has just amazing models all around. To be fair, actually, a fucking vast quantity of Age of Sigma models are dope as shit. I really like oh, yeah. what's there. Um, the what's that other uh, like small scale game they made? Um, um, it's Mech Warrior, based, I think? No, no, based in Age of Sigma. Uh, it's fantasy oh, small uh, board. It's oh fuck. The uh, the skirmish game. Yeah, yeah, the skirmish one. Um, uh, Silver Tower or something. God, I can't remember, but the models for that are fucking so good. They are so good. Oh, oh the, these demons of Slanish are... 
Very nice. Jeez, everything is at least ninety dollars. Yeah. G Dubs got a little bit better when they they came under a new CEO, but uh, emphasis on a little. Let's see, what the fuck was it called? Uh, Night Vault um, uh, for Underworld. Uh, Shade Spire, there you go, Shade Spire. That was what they called it. The Shade Spire models are so good, they're crisp. But another thing is that. I... There's some decisions about like the Age of Sigmar that I think are like fucking stupid. On the other, on the other hand, I can't I can't really think of how they could have. Uh, eh, fuck it. They, 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 uh, how about the fact that they tried to sell you, like they sold you the box right with a few mm -hmm. models, but no rules for the models. Oh yeah, the rules are separate. Yeah, although I mean, at the, the same time, there was there was no cost in them doing it. Age of Sigma made them a lot of money because no one was fucking playing fantasy except for that hardcore few. Yeah, and those people point. may have gotten pissed off. Only half of them quit. The others still went and played fucking Age of Sigma and just did their own rules. And then the rest of the people who picked up the game wanted to play with cool toys and smash them together and didn't care that much. And that's where all the money came from. Yep. It's super hard to get salty about one of the best business decisions they've ever made with Warhammer Fantasy. Oh, yeah, I mean, it's, it, I mean, Fantasy. yeah, I mean, you know, it's, just, it's just EA I, tactics. I, that's all. It's just. I have a question. I have a question. I... All right. We ready to roll? Yeah. God, this is a lot of character sheets. I'm going to have. Well, oh yeah, I don't know if you heard Scal, but basically. We're being led into the location where most of the fighting is going to go, because that's what you asked for. Woohoo! So, uh, yeah. We got lots of vampire killing. Yes! That's exactly what I wanted. Yep. Alright, so... The shrinks. <laughs> The shrikes will direct you uh, away from the basalt tower and deeper th in and through the wood. And then stop. And all in unison just sniff the air. We'll turn to you fizzy and uh, say. Rite of blood will soon be done. Our maddened sister waits with glee. Okay. And then she says that you can see rising up above the trees a column of smoke and blood and ash. It rises up as high as a sky. As soon as it touches that arcane darkness, there is a rumble, and rain begins to fall. <clears throat> All but right. It is no ordinary rain. No. As it lands on and about you, it is red, the irony smell. The rain of blood is upon you. Yes. So, friends, I've just been informed that something else going on out here is called the Rite of Blood, and that's what we're going to go over there and stop before it fucks us all completely over. May well, I make an good. academic knowledge necromancy? Uh, you did get a success on this island, so yeah, you can try. So how are your swinging arms when it comes to decapitating that kindred? Uh, wait, vampire, wrong game. <laughs> the what, <Trent>, sorry? <laughs> sorry, uh, nosebleed there for a second. Because I figure Boy. if we're fighting vamp I feel like I figure if we're fighting vampires in the rain, we should probably cut them when they try to drink look up to the sky and drink from the blood from the air. Yes. Yeah. So kill them like turkeys. I suppose point of curiosity, Avon Glad, is this 
sky falling above actually restoring you in any measure, or...? Uh, yes. Even glad it feels as if it, uh, is restoring you just like drinking from a, um, uh, fresh... No, oh dear. This is troubling. The kindred are going to be able to regenerate while we're fighting them. And that's fine, we'll just kill them even harder. And you know what, um... Actually, wait, since it's raining blood, what did the bulls of scimitars do? Yes! That's fair point. Do you offer some of the Skyfall to them? I mean, I'll pull out the blade and see. All right. Better we oh, out right. now. Oh, Better we fought I doubt now than in the heat of combat. Yeah, as a drop of blood lands on the steel, they burst into f hmm. and. Yeah, um, I guess I will give you the secret. Let's see. When the Bloodfire Blades are sanctified in the lifeblood of sacrifice, they are imbued with dark fire. This allows the wielder of the Bloodfire Blades to attack up to six yards away, and forces their targets to take a negative 20% to parry at it. I have created this chain. If the sacrifice is a vampire, the blades deal plus one damage and gain the impact quality. In either case, this benefit lasts for the duration of combat. So this stabbing... is the blood of a vampire. Oh! <laughs> yeah, so what? you draw these swords, they light on fire, and now you just want to yeet us to lead us into the army? Oh man. Hmm, blood of vampires, you say? I think, yeah, it's ri it's it's the rating of vampire blood. Mm, excellent. Oh, I pull out a thing. I pull out a fucking vial and just like start collecting. Oh yeah, oh, yeah your magic too. powers are powered by that shit. <laughs> Have fun <laughs> shadow blooding. I don't know why, but I wish I could grow a beard and had a son. Boy. <laughs> I just wish I had a death metal band. I also wish we had a death metal band. I take off the mask because he has white face paint and black eyes with like the fucking All right. paint. Okay, everything is breaking up. Yeah, it is set to start sound real crinkly here. I got okay. it. That's not just me. Yep, I fix. I will fix. Hello? Hello? Hey, there we go. Hmm, mm, that was a tough one. Uh, that was ready. <laughs> Yeah, I took us from east to west this time because Central broke earlier this morning super hard. Yeah, Discord's been having a rough time today. Because really all of Google's services are getting hammered by the Chai Coms or something. Uh, I couldn't even fucking get into Google Docs. Are you still Robo, Mez? Um. I hear you fine, but am I right? You're okay. Uh, you're yeah, you're cutting out, but you might just be coming off your push to talk too soon. Uh, uh, no, no, I've still got... Well, I had still just been on, like, um, a 33% packet loss rate. Uh, test, test. Can anyone hear me? Yeah, we got you. Yes. All righty, then. So, I owe you a... Uh, information for your academic knowledge, necromancy. Uh, you did what now? She owes you a explanation with your necro check that you made. Okay. Yeah, so... It's very... Oh, no, oh, that's no. Tabo Rebo. Well... Uh, actually, yeah. I hear you guys fine, it's just Maz that's too, super robot right now. Yeah, that's what happened to me. I'll try USC again. All right. Test, test. One. Yep. Hello, hello. Hello hey. again. For some reason, half of you sound quieter than before, but you know you want robots now. Beep, boop. That's good. All right. So, 
it's very likely the rite of blood is a magical sacrifice and um, a component and a component in activating the wellspring of dark magic that uh, that that uh, is central to this island. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, something tells me we don't want to find out where it actually is. Like if we if we interrupt this right, they might be limited in how much power they may be able to draw from the island itself. Normally, I disagree, considering this is a vampire. We don't want anything making this fight harder than it needs to be. Also, these blades are on fire, and I'm feeling rather confident. Well, let's let's get killing. I mean, honestly, how many of them can be vampires? And also, how many of them like silver crossbow bolts covered in fire? <laughs> well, considering that this is mostly von Karstein lineage. No, um... I'm already bored. Moving on. <laughs> Yeah. Yes, let's hurry up and stop it, right? Yeah. You know, Forever is of the essence. The long <laughs> you are very in pain. And she's already wrapping fucking rags and pulling out lantern oil and pouring it on them to get some fucking fire on her silver crossbows. Going in. I need a marching order facing east. Um, let me get these wolves out. East or weast? East. Done. Don't, Don't you put that evil on me, Ricky Bobby. You say that I already snuck up ahead? Um, way further ahead um, than everyone else? Sure. Well, I will uh, take you along for a moment. Um, and, you know, pop you down on the map. Who, uh, Filbert? Yeah. Yes. Uh, Watch as I get that way, he, he can. Oh, well, he's already snuck mm -hmm. off. That's the thing. I was about, just about to say, could I cast a spell on him for? He's gone. Damn, I he's not going to cast a spell on. Even started. He hasn't. Yeah, he literally hasn't shown up yet. We have not seen Philbert Fiedler. As far as we are concerned, he's fucking hell, get your midget ass back here. He's he's gone. Just going to put Philbert on the map so he can, you know, have a look at what's waiting for you immediately. Uh. Is it vampires? Ah, uh, I can't say. It is. In it is intentional. This is all illuminated. The giant um, you know, vortex of ash and blood and smoke is, you know, casting everything in a red glow. <laughs> Shit. So, it would be a visible flag that's position. Yeah. Mm. Would you like okay. to fall back to your friends and rip? Yeah, that would be a very nice idea. Get everyone around so we don't have to face a massive fucking army of rights from the front. We would want to smash them in the asshole. Please don't eat my assholes, white. Yeah, yeah that with that. That'd be very nice to do. Look, murder sure. doesn't believe in facing everyone face to face. That defeats the point of murder. That's just killing. And although it is fun, also, murder just, can be done for all places. I'm just gonna roll this for right before we get to the fights. So I don't fucking forget, but. You, know. you don't drop a frost fiend on our asses. I'm, I'm gonna try not to. Cause I'm only using one magic dice. So. I'm gonna ready an action to kill a frost fiend. Right. I mean, it's not an unwise choice. Also, roll twenties freezing for me. God damn it. This I love the idea rough. of like your out of combat casting. Just means that all of us are committed to early on <laughs> uh, firing on wherever you're supposed to be pacing. Uh, okay. Uh, on your own time, roll twenty. I did it. Oh, Yay! Well, I failed. Did it. Come on. <laughs> yeah, that was a one. Yeah. Uh, Go ahead. Test your willpower. Okay. 
fuck <laughs> God, you guys suck in the big one for magic god. this session. Oh my <laughs> god! I enjoyed no. an insanity point. Uh, fucking, how many insanity points do I have? I have two already. I think I'm just gonna have to fortune point. Ooh. That. Yeah, you know, you know, has like that, six. That, that's that's okay. Two is nothing. Yeah, uh, that's you, true, you, actually. There's no we negative don't effect. We don't care get to six. Okay, you know, that's that's fair. Also, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say, okay, we have an immediate concern. If that's the problem we have, I would like to try casting the spell. Look, you've already successfully been terrible at casting. I'm gonna I'm gonna put it out there. I don't think we have high expectations right now. I would like to try casting Vision of More. Ooh. Sure, what does that do? You see a thousand you, bottles. You pray to more and ask for a vision relating to a problem you are currently experiencing. The GM secretly rolls a fellowship test on your behalf. If successful, you receive a vision that relates to your problem and a potential solution. And they offer clues to help you resolve it. If the test is failed, you receive a bizarre vision that seems like it might have meaning, but is really just confusing garbage. Sure. Well, I can't wait for the cryptic to keep a spell. Yeah, I can't wait for the cryptic kill the undead, please. And I have a 60 fellowship. This will work. Extra doubt. Okay, so, let's see Father Fletcher. Yes, oh, exactly 60. I, I thought it would be a weird, so many of your things are weird numbers. Alright. Please, no confusing dribble. I can't go forward confusing dribble. You see a vision of knives flashing in the night. see corpses falling, blood spraying. You see a... A pyramid of sandstone crested with marble. You see a sphinx crumbling under the weight of its ages. And a helmeted man laughing as his flesh melts under uh, under withering fire. Spoopy. Very helpful. <laughs> uh, that, that, that sounds like I got the confusing drivel. Well, I'm gonna be honest, <laughs> after some of the things that have happened today, we probably wouldn't listen to you anyways. I am Maybe. trying! Yeah, you're trying, Maybe but you're you failing. just have to go and burn down a pyramid. It's fine. Fucking Perfect more, lot. Goddamn to be honest, I already had Operation set Silver Fire to the fucking vampires. I'm not- I'm not feeling Ravel. Although, coincidentally, Merz, I, the character, well, I, the player, I know more about that vision than any of the other players. This feels mean. <laughs> oh, God, Sniffy, you, you know that's something the, um, the Morites actually did? Like, the Black Guard, um, they... Yeah. They, they joined one of the Imperial Crusades to Araby, and they just kept going through Araby, straight into Kemri, and tried their be very best to wreck shit every And you know what? They make a particularly fine set of Kemri soldiers these days. <laughs> oh no, most of them came back um, after having accomplished very little in the... Yeah. That's not how you win a war, but I admire their spirit. 
They're in. I'm pretty they're sure he's in. Here's the thing. That was mostly Knights of the Raven, who their entire creed is kill everything that's not breathing. <laughs> can can we keep going with the adventure, please, <laughs> before I fall asleep? Yep. So, did you want to actually attempt to outflank them? Uh, that sounds like a really good idea, yeah. I'd very much like that, because even if we don't manage to outflank right. them, if we at least... Uh, Swap, change the position up a bit. That'd be nice. Did I get the ramp blocked. I'm not getting through that anytime soon. We can only flank them from the top because the bottom seems to have a bit of a different height. So. Between Philibert and the Shrikes, you can find your way up and around. So let's drag Just you in. Oh, Jesus. So goddamn many. Oh, yeah, like Jesus Christ. Christ. Hey, guys, who's ready for another fucking uh, Shrike as hell? Oh, is it time for the tentacle party? Apparently it's tentacle time. Hooray! There's a princess. There, there's no princess here. God damn it. Oh, but they're two knight-looking cunts. Hey, come on. They have big swords, pommels, and everything. Well, they certainly led us to the place where the most vampires and everything was. Dude, we're the most stopping, stopping them from reaching the wellspring of darkness seems like a solid play, all things considered. I'm not saying you're wrong. I'm just saying, holy fuck. Fuck yeah. Keep, keep in mind... If we shut down the, this, like, out of character, if we shut down this, they're kind of hamstring about what they can do with the item. Let's yeah. hope that's the case, and that we're not just assuming. God, can we get any closer than this without, like, having a roll initiative? Because we're just so far away, my god. Sounds like a stealth check to me. You can get up to there without having to make any stealth checks. After that, skeleton archers will definitely spawn. Oh god, there are two filibuts. <laughs> yeah. Philibus, Philibus. The doom filibut. <laughs> Philibert, the filibut. I still it's fucking <laughs> doing. <laughs> no. Brother. Good, uh... <laughs> <laughs> gonna leave it like that. This is no notice. That's the reason why he's been so successful as a thief. He has a identical, secret, a secret twin. identical twin. Wasn't there? A no, magic? it's the other Hobbit that's underneath his cloak. Um, <laughs> that's when they pose as a human. Yeah, yeah that's that's human. <laughs> right. Wait, wasn't there oh, a something? Move? Don't what you always find it weird work? that he's... Oh my god! Oh, I want everyone to be real quiet like you tip of your toes. Like Dude, this. I can't wait for you to literally steal their boots. That's a lot of boots. Wait, I wonder, can you just steal the arrows from the archers? I probably can. Perfect, <laughs> 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 you cut. Sure, he can take all of their arrows. He cannot take all of their ammunition. Oh, oh did you shoot bones? This is pick up their own rib cages. Oh my god! The classic <laughs> rib, rib bones of doom. <laughs> One of them just fucking shoots a bit of bread land. Yeah. Well, no, they form. What they do is they they one skeleton surrenders both of its arms with fingers already posted to flip the bird, and another skeleton shoots them. <laughs> Cool. And if that fails, then they shoot the femur. Hmm. <laughs> and if that fails, they just throw the fucking skull at him and the fucking uh, just keeps biting him. There's any notice. Yeah. Should... <laughs> no, no, no. I tend to. The knights and steal their swords. Seems to look perfectly uh, safe. But she. This is going to get dicey, guys. Yeah. Uh, 
I love mine. <laughs> I love me and Everclad's fucking initiative. Let's tie it six strong. That's their strong initiative, try that. This is like a sin strat from Jojo. This is a standard. All right. Like one round into this fight tonight. Most likely. I'm um, once again. So I'm saving. So I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try and body block for you. So you know, when you start casting a spell, I will literally stand between you and the death and shoot silver crossbow bolts at people. Uh, I appreciate it. I will also appreciate getting to ride uh, or get dragged by Polnareff's horse by like twenty feet or so, so I can actually hit things. I don't think you want to be dragged. I do. I'd rather just get dragged on my face than stand here for the rest oh, of the time. Oh, that's not a name I wanted to read. Let's well, flesh oh, drag. No. Oh, flesh. Oh. Oh no. Oh, hey, it's a Genric. I remember. Even Clint hates that guy. <laughs> you what? He's here, and he's got yeah. a flesh dragon. Oh, a fucking. Flesh yeah, dragon. I have a flesh dragon too. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I do. It's called my burning hatred for him. Oh, wait, that's just my bone. What the hell? What the fuck? Oh, I really hope I can command down the Shrike. Um, actually, DCL, now I'm looking at things. With your uh, power boner weapon, you know, I tell you what be, you'd be sort of really good doing in this moment. Uh, uh, just literally wading through the, uh, fuck block of whites. I mean, we can hope. I I don't have cleave. But you do, you know, plant yourself in the middle of a fight and kill lots of people. Now at range, right. so you can multi-attack like a fucking beast. Yeah. yeah. With so impact. A thing happens. And then... Fuck. Aiden Cloud, it's your turn. Uh, Philippa, you are successfully hit. Good. I mean, I rolled a 1 on a 114 chance. Uh, I bet you think it would be successfully hidden. But yeah, Aiden Cloud, you are up first. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. So, the person I really want to kill is me. So I'm just going to have to settle for second best. Is it eight squares? I don't like these Kabola Acolytes, because the Acolytes are always casting shit. Is, is the Acolyte casting shit? Is he the one maintaining little blood well? They are standing there, there with their hands clasped together, but uh, there is no chance. Hmm. Hmm. I don't like the <gasps> acolytes, though. Hold on. Okay. Oh, uh, sorry. Hey, Marzendi, how big is a large template? That's a hand. Oh, wait. Yards. Yeah, six uh, yard diameter. Oh, sorry, sorry, no, ten yard diameter, so five squares across. Oh, okay, I forget the square conversion in this goddamn game. So I have a movement of eight, so I can move eight squares, correct? Yes. Alright, I'm going to charge this Kibel Acolyte, because fuck these Acolytes, and everything they stand for. And I'm going to do so, charging over here, and then... Smacking it. Yeah, I'm going to charge down right there. So. Actually, I should hide behind this tree. This is a tree, right? Um, where? Sorry, I can't see where you are. Right here? Oh, uh, that's a bush. Fuck. Stay away you from the hide behind the bush. Stay away from the bush. You know better. Oh, you got a good point. 
got a good point. But yeah, you you could indeed um, run up and sn take cover behind the bush, or that would require a stealth roll. But you could. Uh, I just want cover from arrows, honestly, which it doesn't seem like the thing I'm gonna get. So instead, I mean, if you crouch, then it's something. Uh, you know what? Fuck it. I'm just gonna come over here and whack this guy. I'll be like right here. Before anyone else gets in position. Are you guys going? What if you was on a horse? Are you going to get in position? I assumed that this was going to go foobar the minute any of you actually took a turn. Yeah, no, you've made the smartest decision by literally diving in. Like, I'm, I'm just going to attack this guy. All right. Yeah, the sure. show. I like that. Yeah. Go ahead, um, pop your. Oh, yeah, yeah, you. Um, actually, uh, is that. Yeah, that's eight yards. You need to be one square closer because that. Oh. You know what? Mages are mages. They they don't like when you cast in melee, right? Or I think it's the wrong system again. Uh, casting in melee has no impact, but they are typically bad at defending themselves in melee. It. Running in, attacking. I'll pay for the consequences later. Boom. Oh, wow. I... Um, I am going to say he is surprised just because you came <laughs> at such a speed. It's like one of one of these fucking bone boys is vaguely going clack, clack and pointing in the direction <laughs> of dudes and now there's a vampire <laughs> in his asshole. Yeah. <laughs> So you can skip directly to the damage rolling phase. Alright. Remember the bonus damages and shit. I did. I just corrected that. Well, nice. I'm going to upgrade that 7 by 2, I believe. So, 18? Yeah. Oh! 18, you said. Yeah. Bye. That's a, a, a nice um, zero health. Mm -hmm. uh, also, DCL, please remember, don't use, you know, the weapon skill roller, use, like, the actual we um, attack roller for your individual weapon, since that gives us hit locations and stuff. Oh. Oh yeah, sorry, sorry. You know, since you aced him in one hit, could you just make a stealth roll and see, like... <laughs> just assassin creed him back into the bush. Exactly. Oh, wow, yes. I guess, yeah. Fuck it, I'll take it. I'm not gonna say no to a free. Uh, drop me a concealment troll. Clickety clack, where went Jack? Jesus fucking shit! Yeah. <laughs> Way to really fill but feedler this attack. <laughs> Alright, so. No, even skeletons yeah. are going like clickety clack, where was Jack? Alright, so Aiden clad basically just seems to blink up, skewer a man on his sword, and then, um, just. Vanish out of the bush. <laughs> you uh, drag his corpse as well, you just yeah, dump him in. Action, yeah, quick action time. Yeah. But still, uh, blood was spilt. The, uh, <clears throat> and as it sprays out, it lands amidst the circle, and the pillar darkens, and you hear a Maniacal sing song laugh. So. Is that the laugh I recognize? Oh no. no. Okay. No, it's it's my it's it's my new friend. I'm gonna have to persuade them to be less insane. Oh, the the little fairies. No, this is their their boss. Oh. Hmm. Their maddened sister. Hmm. All right, Philip. So first things first, in order to rob people, have to run up. So that'll be four, that'll be another four, and... Oh, I can just leap that far. I leap! <laughs> I leap up the fucking cliff, and I proceed to steal arrows. <laughs> Alright, uh, you are... You are short, they're looking over the top of your head. Um. Drop me a um, 
let's see, I believe sleight of hand test will pass 20 because they are distracted with my <laughs> enemies. <laughs> there is no reason in the world that these strats should work. But they I'm do. Sorry. We're high enough level that they work. Alright, eight degrees of success. Um, so I guess I'll just go through it. Yeah, you, you just uh, get all these uh, skeletons arrows. What what's a nice thing for out of ammo? Um, um I guess. Hmm. Uh, the broken arrow sign. Broken arrow? Where's that? No, my initial I don't part. see no broken arrow. Uh, People into the platform oh, are going chaos magic, but then I remember they don't have an arcane language. Um, maybe the lock. Yeah. Lock one. Where is Andy? Let's hypothetically say I was to draw power from this portal. Could I use this per mortal? <laughs> hypothetically, of course. Oh my God, snap. I would never use chaos magic drawn from such a source, of course. <laughs> Alright, four skeletons. You now have four quivers uh, strung across your back. Um, like the got skeletons all are chattering to them. Clickety clack. And now you throw a chunk of warp stone inside the blood fountain. I wish I don't have a chunk of warp stone. Uh, yeah, it, was, it would be a shame rat if somebody in this party had a chunk of warp stone that they've been hiding this whole time. Well, would Save you in? Uh, no. Is there something you'd like to tell me? No. Yoka had those two potions. Oh. Mm -hmm. Save it. Is it when next turn I use all my actions? Uh, Alright, uh, Rosalind. Uh... Please tell me I haven't been butt fucking a demon. <laughs> and you have the option to, you know, be properly fucking on. I That's not answering my question. She'll move up here at next time she'll start climbing. This is seeming like not so good an idea, <laughs> but it will be fun, I think. <laughs> oh, the God. balls on that lass. There's something he's just running up the fucking slope. Okay, I guess we're just gonna assault the summit here. Oh fuck! It's just that's just the plan, is it? I mean, I'm just following the two part. The two PCs lead here. <laughs> All right, two Chancellery Knights. Uh, you are vampires. I think you have movement six. Can vampires be put to sleep? What do you think? A hopeful answer. That shows your. Terrible naivete. Father Fletcher! Yeah, the two Chancellery Knights leap down, uh, readying their great swords as they do. Hello? Hello? Yeah, we heard that. Uh, there are people charging you with swords, what do you do? Oh, uh, shit. Toot! <laughs> Every single dude. Every single guy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and just cast, cast, cast the spell. Disappoint us. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, I did actually remember the shrikes. That's good. Yep. <laughs> no doubles. Alright, well. 
anyone who's in that aura, um, you'll get a plus one to damage. Oh. Nice. Every single time. Yep. Do remember to keep track of um, that. You ironically went from the most overpowered and useful character to arguably the once a useless, but his numbers are not his dice are not for him. I, he made it. He succeeded. Okay. I, uh, um, uh, Look, I, I mean, it's Ramsfall for trying to bring redemption to the worst people. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it, 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 right. everyone told him. It all flicked from where they had uh, been around Fizzy to just start. Swarm this chancellery knight. Yes. Go, my little sweetlings. Oh, no. uh, I really like having a cadre of murder you guys. That's all I ever wanted. Adorable. I didn't know I wanted I, it until I saw it, and now I know that I do and I want it. I, I, know, it. I, I think I remember rolling, I mean, not rolling, uh, reading about the these little spites, and they're fucking awesome. Oh, oh they're great. Oh, yeah! God. It Shouldn't begins. have taken that, boyo. Admit, didn't actually do much, but still. Oh, uh, right. I forgot these guys are OP as fuck. That's an admirable yeah. hit at the very least. <laughs> they swarm around him, just slashing and stabbing. Small as they are, it's all but impossible to find gaps in a heavy plate. Oh, wait, actually, no, I, I forgot to give them a charge thing. They should have actually hit one more time, so... They, they do actually get that, even though they don't get outnumbering bonuses. <laughs> Not that it helped. Um... Also, uh, Vaska, you wanted to be on Polnareff's horse. Uh, yeah. Are Polnareff, you sure? Polnareff, is that agreeable? It is. Alright. So... Leave a lady behind like that. Well, it's Polnareff's turn. Well. Oh boy. Oh boy, here it comes. Here comes that boy. Uh, I can try. Best I can do, right? I assume there's no way to just, you know, gallop my way up here. Not easily, no. Okay. All right. You could perhaps have your horse jump um, <laughs> no. for the right test, but uh -huh. if you falter, uh, there is a chance you and Vaska may be thrown, and <laughs> not just thrown wild, but thrown into the uh, blood vortex. Oh, yes. Why wouldn't I leap into that? I didn't think Vasco was going to... I thought she was going to slide off the horse when she got a reasonable enough distance I mean, anyway. Yes, I, I would like to slide off the horse, like, around here somewhere. Let me see. And that's an option. Yeah, I, I just need to be closer. I don't need to be in melee with, these, with anything. I'm still just a little wizard. I actually you are the wizard of peace. Yes, I am the blizzard wizard. Pardon, sorry, Bob? I was asking if I'm actually close enough to... I'm actually not. Really? I mean, what's the speed in your... Oh, I'm actually Square's looking at not, myself. Square's not yards. Uh, it does help if I opened up the horse. Nah, that... Ah, yeah. With the order. Yeah, eight. So, As a horse uh, user, I tell you, you can definitely charge this on the pictures. The charge is 16. Okay, I was looking at Pawner. But Pawner was... <laughs> yeah, you've already <laughs> done an on-foot charge this session. You've done enough. <laughs> you need to dismount, grab your horse, and charge with it on top of your fucking back. Hey, you just swap places. Very Britannian. <laughs> <of you. laughs> The mm. fucking horse Sam. holds it like it's its mouth. You don't know how tempted I am to just ignore this vampire here and go, uh... Then do it! Charge up there! Mm. Just, you know, pass the right test! Uh, just fall into the blood warp, I guess. Yeah, <laughs> I, I believe do. in you, Bob. Do the thing. 
it would be cool if you managed to make it up there and kill them. Also, be cool if you found the vortex with Vasco. Look, like I said, I'm hopping off this thing halfway, no matter what. So, I'll do it. Yes, I I can do it. Be a man. Be a Bretonian. Be a Bretonian. Well, no, no, be better than that. Uh oh, what'd I get? Really? You were oh. worth 70? Come on, man. I I've done fucking twice as risky checks. With far less target numbers. Yes, but I have bad rolls. I mean, that's yeah, fair enough. Doubt. Remember what I said about doubt, Rob? Alright, so I get so I guess one of those skeleton archers are about to have a bad time. Possibly two. Uh what's the Alright, you hit him. Not really much, uh, anything they can do. Ah, oh, so close. I mean, it's good enough. Wait, don't you fury on an eight? No, uh, nine. Uh... And I guess the other one also gets a bad time. Yeah. Yay. Are you wow. fucking... No. 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 Done. No. So we're speaking of bad roll. Yeah, I'm going to fortune. Yeah. No, don't do it, please. For the little guys, not worth it. No, it's, I think I can fortune into this. It's, it's more the, the, the ditching a crit fail there. Yeah. Because it is a crit fail, you do actually have to reroll. Oh, gosh darn it. You're not gonna get a hundred, it's gonna be fine. See? <laughs> How about by the completely opposite factor <laughs> instead? Perfectly Perfect. fine. Oh. Is well, that, that another fucking double nine? Ooh. Yes. Well... <sighs> Can you just I say mean... that he aces an extra skeleton for that? <laughs> his lance is not quite long enough, so <laughs> it's just no. his lance isn't quite long enough. Mm. Just two skeletons are smashed to pieces. Feezy. Hi there. Uh, although I wanted to guard Vaska, she's actually gotten quite a bit far away from me. <laughs> Super annoying to not <laughs> fire a flaming three flame, flaming crossbow bolts and instead fire one flaming crossbow bolt. Darn it! I'm gonna do it anyway. Okay. Move to here. <laughs> Actually, I, wait. I have to flame them one at a time on this thing anyway because it has a, it's a fucking uh, <laughs> it's a repeated crossbow, so I can only load that onto one arrow at a time, or it won't fire. So I guess I'll fire my one flaming arrow at the uh, Chancery Knight uh, that is surrounded by strikes. Cool. Okay. Wait, right. did you not reload it? Hmm? No, this, this thing takes a while to reload and I don't need to fire it more than once in a fight because then everything's in my face. But I do like firing uh... three times when I fire it once in a fight. Let's see, um... Yeah, I guess I'll try to dodge him. No. It's, you know, actually on fire, it's moderately threatened. It is silver and on fire. Well, whip. Fire by All fucking hell. Right. Yeah, One I will, uh, function. I'm gonna quick draw a shield. I'll just hold it loose in my hand until I can swap it for a weapon. Cool. And charge Polar. That's I knew it. Ghostly sword. I figured, Vaska. I figured. Um. 
Where's... Ah. Just mash that paste key a few times, give some extra ones to toss your... <laughs> if you could just make a stack in a corner somewhere, that'd be great. <laughs> Lie them out like fucking poker chips. Alright, would you like to be decapitated by a um, white blade? I'm assuming... Uh, that's a no. That's a... That's a hard no. Oh. Alright. So... Neither of those happen this turn, so the next fallen champion... Can also <laughs> champion. Oh no. I was not prepared for two of them. Oh no. Uh, Ride Jack. Oh no. Well, I mean, it's attacking you, it's not attacking your horse. But yeah, good. Um, so let's see. Uh, did I leave any template friends on Melton? No, I got rid of them all. That was silly of me. I knew this was coming. <laughs> we all knew it was coming. You know, if I was saying I would have gotten a fucking fire wizard. Yeah. Right. If I was saying I would have gotten the Morite. No, it's secretly no, no, it's... a Kron worshiper. No, you just you just. Oh yeah, of course, yeah. No, yeah, then it makes sense. I'm pretty sure conflagration of. Doom would actually work really well right now. Yeah, if I were smart, I'd be playing the Green Maiden. I don't know. No, because Conflagration of Doom is great because it is one of the few spells that has an effect similar to the lines of it keeps burning until everything in the area is dead. I'm familiar. There you are, Saven. Five template friends uh, to stop. Hey. Just to get you started. It off. I'll need all, all right. of them. Cabal Acolyte. We'll continue chanting. Uh, Please. Oh, they weren't chanting. Uh. They were just standing there with their hands clasped together as if in prayer. Um. Uh, but yeah, they will continue to do that. Far off in the uh, distance, to the northeast, from behind the that you came, you hear the sounds of uh, hooting and uh, hollering, whooping voices. Vaska. That seems like a seems like a bad time. Um, let me let me just read this real quick to make sure uh, this works the way I, I'm hoping it does. Here, oh. B, I gotta get the doggos. Question, when are we ending tie? Are we just ending at uh, the start of Aiden Cloud's next turn or Ah uh, yeah, we'll probably call it after this one. Okay. So you know in like another half hour's time. That's cool. We've got what, five more turns. Yeah, it... We are gonna Here kill we so many people. Reach is actually much. Here... It's te uh, just so you're aware, template friends aura isn't visible to anyone else, so we don't actually know how much space is being uh... tentacled. Oh, uh, that's an important thing to know. Hey, there we are. All right. Um, gonna. Could be what ten. Gonna do a thing, I guess. Let's let's see how this works. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and cast my spell. Uh, and Vasco will put a hand on her stomach and just kind of concentrate for a moment, and hope for the best. We're gonna go ahead and roll. Let's see. 
I guess. Um, Uh, do 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 do. Yay! I did it. <laughs> well, what horror is is you just roll on the minor zinch table? This. How are you rolling so many doubles with only four dice? I feel like this should be statistically. What the odds of no? The odds of that are super duper high. Well, okay. I guess I just don't know math. Oh, oh wow, that's so you go Super Saiyan, all right? I don't know. It seems pretty easy to not roll doubles. Right. Yeah. Well, uh, that's sure enough to catch Shoika's call. So all those dudes are gonna take nice, F that actually might. fifteen damage. Can Thank spells, you. uh, fucking? Yes, yes, they can. Yeah. Nice. Yep. Come on. Oh. Ah. Oh. All it right. Um, I mean, they do get their agility tap. Yeah. Well, I can, I can take a guess who's gonna pass. Champions. Ooh. Oh, so one of them. Wow. Yeah. Well, that went better than expected. Uh, so they have. Ah, oh, this ignores armor, doesn't? It? Mm hmm Okay, so uh, that uh. His health. And, uh, oh god, I forgot right how much back. health they had. Destroys two skeleton arch. Now, are you getting boosted damage from uh, my aura as well? Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. Uh, He's gonna have some fun. Heal. Okay, I've got well, one hit point. Oh, no, okay. Bye, statue. Uh, yeah, he's he's basically dead. <laughs> he just had his butthole waiting for him. Just... <laughs> Not the top. <laughs> Only one skeleton. Wa Man, those are some impressive. And it does get a white, so he's sh He actually has enough health that it might be worth keeping him around. Uh, well, you did do 16. 17. 7. Oh, That's the actual correct number. Devastated. Yeah. Alright, so speaking of whites, uh, the others, well, are going to have to march. Um, if, they, if they march into the aura, do they get have to roll to get schlorked? Yep. Yep. They are marching Aww. up towards you. They think they're being clever. Scare. Oh, and actually, uh, the guy in there does get his uh, strength to try to break. No, he does. Alright, skeleton warriors. Uh, so I've got to do three more tests because Shoika's, you know, does actually happen. Wow. Uh, and... I'll march up this way, so trying to envelop you, uh, skeletons down here. As so well, just clamber up onto the plateau, ready to serve as a new record. Skeleton archers, uh, ones further away, um, uh, are all going to shoot Polar out. You have a shield, yes? Yes. Okay, so that'll cancel out their aim, so, uh, that's just 8 Once again. <laughs> Two hits. Gonna, uh, so. 
Yeah, I'll soak them. I said, don't think I have any other choice. Oh boy. You are you are even more of a pincushion than before. <laughs> uh, corpse Colossi, you have So from memory guys, how much of a threat are these? They hurt if they hit, but they're not very good at it. That's not reassuring. <laughs> sure it is. One will charge. This one will just charge fizzy. Um, so yeah, fizzy. It's coming at you with a bone. Nope, it misses. So now we come to the end of the first round, and yeah. Uh, next time, we'll pick up with you trying to, uh, claim this sacred grove, and... In the um, name getting... of murder! Hooray! Yeah! Yeah, and getting as many undead as, the, uh, as are spared on the island, all converging on you. Uh, so... Mars? I don't... <laughs> so let's hypothetically say someone was to cast Summon Demons in the Blood Purple. It would be an interesting strategic choice. Glad to know. I'll keep that in mind. Wait, I just had a thought. Don't hurt yourself. <laughs> oh, I'm funny. <laughs> And then we like to joke here. I could draw a boundary line. <laughs> Would they not be able to cross it? Essentially, all undead would have to make a, a, I think, a difficult willpower test in order to cross a line. Yeah, but how long is that line, and how are you going to do it all? Like, it's eight yards long at max. Look do at this place, man. Comes. It's fucking massive. Do it in case so, the dragon comes. Anyway. So hide. I, I wonder if I could... Anyway. anyway. Let's do XP. Yay. Uh, did you explore a new and interesting location? Yeah, this place. Fuck yeah. Yep. Did you learn an interesting truth about another player character? I have a Shrike cadre. I can summon them in the name of murder. This place is a holy sight to me now. Hooray. Uh, well, that's not yeah. inaccurate. Yeah, I'm, when, once we're done killing all the vampires, I'm going to set up a little chapel. Uh, did you learn an interesting fact about the world or non player character? Uh, let's see. Shrikes are sentient, roughly? Mm. I don't want you to call in the Shrikes twice. Okay, well, uh, fair enough, fair enough. Wait, we learned about, um, the sister in the pool here. Or Vortex, or whatever. They have the meat. Oh, uh, I mean, the, the vampires actually have to unlock a wellspring of darkness. That seems pretty fucking valid. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so that's three. Uh, did you make progress on the... Yeah. Yeah, I mean... Uh, yeah, yeah. I thought we mm -hmm. have. And did you overcome a dangerous challenge? Yeah, the mm -hmm. wolves and... Braves and whatnot. Yeah. Alright. 125 experience. Again. Joke. Nice. I'm not sure what to buy with this character. Well, I mean, I've still got 2,970 more weapon skill to buy, so I guess I should get started on that. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> also, Pat Pat. Ram, you knew what you were doing when you were making more. 
I, I knew I I would do it. I just didn't know how bad it would be. You should have known, man. You should have known. Well, you would girl get... night. <laughs> Apparently, they're pretty sweet. I'm gonna go get more food because I'm hungry now, and also fi fix the fucking oh. bust I just did because I'm a retard. Bye bye. Oh, I'm hungry too. Uh, I should put food in so mouth. Easy. I hope you guys all had fun. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. yeah. I'm sorry yeah. I was late. Yeah, it's yes, okay. It happens. Alright, and if you're watching on stream or YouTube, check back tomorrow for 70. We'll see you then. Have a good one.